BTS recently, so maybe huh. they're getting in on that, trying to <laughs> trying to swing things around, <laughs> so that all the K-pop stands vote Democrat. Uh, they're probably probably Honestly, going to anyway. Tucker Carlson was like he always swings the the stick next to the hornet's nest, but uh, he managed to find some death hornets there. I don't mess with K-pop stands, man. They scary. They will dox you. It's true. I don't know. Mine's mine's pretty accurate. Yours. Take a look. Gotcha. I'm the admin of my own fucking really Discord. If I want to add everyone on my own goddamn server, I'm going to add everyone on my own goddamn server. Jesus. That's a pretty good flag, Cap. Yeah. <laughs> Mental illness, isn't it? Oh, oh god. Wait, are we gonna pop to the other chat? Oh, do y'all have a session today? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I thought y'all just kind of gathered here because people tend to gather here. <laughs> yes, we wanted to gather here for session. Smile. I'm migrating. I suppose yeah, I will yeah. also migrate then. It is time for the great migration. We're heading south for the winter. All right, you fuckers, get out of here. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Early new. Yo. Yo, Letty. Yo, I got here before the DM got in the channel. That's crazy. <laughs> Late DM. What the fuck? That's seventeen. <laughs> I haven't even said That's one yet. Seventeen. That's seventeen. What? Yeah, seventeen. What, Kate? Seventeen. What? You know exactly what I fucking mean, you mongrel. Nope, I don't. Started. I am dumb and stupid and cute. I need you to tell me. Uh, I should probably seventeen. What? Map tools, huh? Yeah, is the server open or? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, another inconsistency, Kate. That's 18. Uh, it's horror, and then what was the pass again? Oh, oh. Can you post it? No, you don't have to say that loud. Did I pin it? I did not. And the, it's the same server name as last time, right? Yep. Yeah. Doesn't change. Okay. It's always the same. I wanted to make sure. I can hear you, Mimas. It's okay. Okay. I found the message, so I'm putting it. Hey. There we go. Now, this isn't the right part of the map. You're... There we go. Letty, you're uh, treading on thin ice here. If I'm gonna get accused I, for it, I'm at least gonna do it. I can't uh I can't guidance you in this campaign. Um <laughs> I think a guy is gonna say if I'm that's funny. I don't think anyone can guidance. No I, uh, No, actually I'm gonna be Your guys are mostly are not of the uh supportive type, actually. Yeah, we don't have a healer. What I'm a support, it's not a healer. 
Um, yeah. I'm planning on taking up some healing with the next few level ups because we desperately need it, I think. No, we don't. Good. I mean, I would always <laughs> appreciate healing, seeing as I use health to cast spells sometimes. <laughs> yeah, this we'll always to... ends up happening. There we I'm going to cruise so much bad karma early on. I can't wait for it. Hey, that's a little bit more visible this time. Good. Okay. I changed Dimitri's token image. My line art was really small on the last one. You all can get gay dice. Uh, from D&D Beyond, let's go. Shit. Gay dice? I was I hadn't thought about her, uh, yeah, real her shit. sexuality. Big gay dice? I have to go look. I'm. I just got some gay dice. Congratulations, you won. The big gay dice. Oh, they're just free. Yeah, they're just free. Free gay dice, and they look cool. Donut. Um. Uh oh. Donut. Oh, those are sick. Where's the link? Don't look up big gay dice on Twitter. What? No, I went to Why D &D Twitter. On. You go, oh, why it, would you not just go gets, straight to D&D Beyond? It gets worse the more you scroll. Oh my god. Oh. Why did you oh, search it on Twitter? Like it's 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 on D&D &D Beyond. You? you you type in D&D &D Beyond and you find it. Okay. It's it at is. the yeah. top of the screen. Hey, part. you can do fucking advantage and disadvantage on fucking D&D &D Beyond? Yeah. yeah. Huh? I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah, like uh I, I, I wait, hold on. Let me yeah, let me test. Like uh Holy shit, you can. It's it's uh yeah. it's what they uh use in uh Oh my god. It's the thing they use in Critical Role. Like if they didn't want to actually roll dice, their uh their little tablets that have their shit on it, you can actually do that. Okay, where are well, the I I always dice? was like, how do you do like advantage and shit? And it like just told me in the email, I was like, Oh, you just right click it? I'm fucking stupid. Yeah, roll as crit damage. Ooh. I've been traumatized. Where are they at? Where, what? Why are where, you traumatized? Where the, dice? where the don't look at Twitter. Where's the dice? You go. You got to go claim them. Where, what? There should be like a little beyond. drop down thing at the very top of the screen, like a little banner. Oh, dice of true color. Yeah. Yeah. Sign in to claim. Okay. I want to sixty-nine d twenties. <laughs> So my computer can hate me. All right. Who would uh, like to re recap what happened last time? Uh, uh, we figure out there was a bunch of time shit going on with this school. We were all very quiet for the most part because mm -hmm. we didn't know what we were doing. And we're in a new place and we don't know anyone yet. We're a bunch of teenagers. Yeah. This is our first day of like actual classes because we spent some time just kind of getting used to the school. This is true. Apparently, there, hell is underneath the school. We yeah, have a hidden objective of keeping uh, Cat's character out of the gym. Please, <laughs> yeah. God. That is also. Can I at least see the image? That's no. primarily my objective since I do go to the gym. I mean, I also go to the gym. Mm -hmm. We must go. I think you're going to find Dimitri in the gym. Yeah. The jocks must ban Cat from the gym. Mm -hmm. Like, like, legit, you all just kind of share the same gym. She's clearly a theater nerd. She doesn't belong in the gym. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Exactly. The fuck? True. She, 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 what is Warlock equal theater nerd? She needs to, <laughs> sure, uh, to jock. She, do you she, when you do when you think warlock, do you think Jim? Cat? Huh? No, I exactly. think golf girl hanging out underneath the bleachers. Get you your know? dumb bimbo exactly. ass back in the theater. No, no, you are in theater class and you're about That's to not my bimbo. and you are about to recite cats in full length. <laughs> there are, there are better cats. musicals to start with. I, why is Billy here? What happened? Oh yeah, he's the coop. Nah, nah, Cat's character strikes me as the picking the edgiest soliloquies from like Shakespeare. Fucking Hamlet. Yeah. 
No, she just looks for dick jokes and then laughs about them. True. The uh, actual wrong. recap, we all started at a new school um, in which there are boundless opportunities and uh, people... Hello? Oh, Freddy has both. Okay. Uh, and um, people of uh, many nations gather, um, some of which are in need of rulers who will pick from the student body regardless of their uh, background. Um, we have all just recently started here, and we are in a class that... Uh, or our classes are focused on adventuring and exploring. So we are currently underneath the school during a time when the school is frozen, which is at, is it nine or 11 PM every night? 11.30. Yeah. 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 So our teacher has just jumped off the side, um, into the lower levels, but we are currently at the top level and about to start exploring. Oh, also I've changed my motives. Okay, which are? I want to just be a literal short king. Did you want to be Napoleon? He wasn't short. He was like, he was like, four he was like, like my eight. Yeah, he's he like my like fucking height. height. Yeah. I mean, he's like five, seven, five, eight. No. He's like yeah, five, no, he four, was like five, 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 seven or five, eight, and he just surrounded himself with super tall guards and stuff, and no one actually saw him up close because, you know, leader of the nation. So he just looked short. Yeah. Because, reminder, people have progressively, over time, begin, been getting taller on average. Damn, I'm I wish that were me. I want to make, <laughs> right? make the obvious joke about Cap, but that's too mean. Yeah, no, no, I went all to my brother. Alright. Well, then we start off the greatest part of it, which is you find yourself at the footholds. You can see above you the endless starry sky of the astral sea. Mm. You can see around you hundreds of little like platforms and rocks are spread across the entire place. In front of you is the actual castle. You can see like how it's split up into weird sections. You can see how the ramps turn up left and right they go in every direction you they go from like large open areas to small fields everything is should is in weird places that it shouldn't be you can even hear the uh flapping of wings heavy leathery in the distance so I can't remember did our teacher actually explain what our objective was or she uh, she told you that uh, Everybody more or less goes through their first uh, trial on the f f first floor who comes into here. So, but the biggest thing is she can't help you. This this has to be done on your own uh, volition. But she can have a guide at least make it so you avoid, you know, falling off the edge or accidentally uh, doing something stupid. That, you know. Okay. That's goth Paimon, right? Yes, that's goth Paimon. So just Paimon? But goth. That's a girl. A sparkly goth. Grandkids? Yeah, that thing. <laughs> just a little but she does kind of float there behind you she's just kind of looking around and kind of goes well you do have to move forward to you know explore Oh, yeah. 
have, but we have to get our bearings first. Land in, land in Stepple. Is it like a pretty clear, just one way forward kind of thing? Or are there yeah, branches, uh, like branching paths? Like the, the beginning part of it is very straightforward. It just kind of goes up, it loops around, but it, there's no branching paths. It, it, it just kind of goes. But just kind of as you walk, you can see that like, you, there is no other land here, uh, like, you could, like, if you, like, ever fell off, like, purposely, you would, you could find yourself drifting for days, but it, it'd be pretty. Well, I suppose all we can do is just start walking. What's the path look like in front of us? It's a hodgepodge of like little bits of land. So like you can see trees hanging off of it. There's overgrowth. There's stone. Um, concrete is like mixed into the path. Um, you can see uh, that there it, that there is like. Uh, Torches on the side, so there, so it does look like people have been through here. At one point or another. Are they lit? They are lit. Yeah, this place is pretty lit. It is pretty lit. Well, I guess we'd be moving forward. Is there anything you would like to ask the core before you uh, move forward? Uh, how many floors are there? Also, I wasn't here when we met that one, that person. Where are they? Like to the school. Uh, she only appears here. So, like a guide. He's the guide in Tartarus. Okay. Un unfortunately, due to restraints, your teacher cannot help you in any way, shape, or form. Um, like, not just because it's your first trial, but also because she's uh, very much farther down and certain restrictions uh, say no to her. Oh, is it like in a Made in Abyss type deal where you can't go back up if you're too yeah. far down? Yeah. Oh, I like that. Yeah, like she is, unfortunately, she cannot help you through most of these places, but she can have guides or uh, certain hints or helps can help you, but she actively cannot help you. Gotcha. Oh, nice. So do you know what we're gonna have to deal with down there? Uh, as for your, as for the floor question, uh, well, it's hard to tell. The rough estimate. Uh, over two hundred. If you're lucky. What if we're unlucky? Uh, seventy. What part of this does luck come into it? Well, uh, the way your teacher would put it when she told me was if you're extraordinarily strong, you can skip ahead a fair amount. Lyndon looks at his weak, noodly arms. Uh, for others, uh, it may take longer. It depends on how the tower judges you uh, adequately. Is 
So we have to do the first floor to find out where we end up? Mm, something like that. Well, let's get it over with, I guess. Yeah, it's not going to clear itself. Uh, Dimitri, you do hear the flapping of dragon wings. Ooh. I'll go to the yeah. edge and look up, look down. They are, like, they aren't, like, like, small ones, like, you expect, like, a wyvern you you hear the like large flapping of wings from an actual like full-size dragon in the distance oh let's get started <laughs> <laughs> stare it's like i'll see it i'm gonna go ahead and do a perception check on like the immediately visible path that we have to take mm -hmm. to make sure there's no like hazards or things waiting to pop out at us. Okay. That is a good point. Um with the twelve, uh they're outside of the obvious like, hey, don't fall off the edge. Uh some of it is unstable. Like it's not exactly the greatest path, but it is Stable enough to walk on. You just got to be very careful how you uh, proceed in times. All right, then I will like fall after Dimitri. Yeah, I'll follow after. Unless you want me to take points, so you're not right at the front. Probably best if you do. Uh, he wouldn't be thinking about that though. So it'd be up to you. All right. Then I'll, I'll walk, like, beside you if you're not, like, specifically falling back to let me take the front. As you guys step through the first instance, you feel your feet touch to the ground. And you feel that, like, your feet sinking into the dirt. Uh, if you are... Um, barefoot you can feel the dirt like digging be between your toes and you watch as the entire area goes from that that overarching castle in the back with all the lands and the towers and you find yourself in a cavern area as the entire area shifts you find yourself Far too big. <laughs> nice. Because what's scaling? Yeah, that'll work. We are ginormous. Right, Mimi? Is that familiar? True. <laughs> right. My kid sister who snuck along. <laughs> who, who cast tongues on that familiar? What's going on? No, no. Oh, boy. She just, she's just baby talking right now. She doesn't know real people wow. talk yet. She's just honking. Mm -hmm. You find yourself here within a cavern. The walls are look like they've been carved out to make at least a solid straight walls. You see uh, the place looks like it hasn't been well taken care of in some time. Who's going to check for traps? Should the rogue check for traps? Do we have a rogue? Yes. Uh, kind of? Yes. Maybe, please. Does anybody want to check uh, for traps? Yeah, I can <laughs> check for traps. <laughs> um, Dimitri should probably not check for traps, is what I'm going to I'm just going to make another general perception check while he checks for traps. Yeah. He'll, he'll now also do the perception Ooh. check. I will like to perceive with my eyes. Please perceive. Do I see anything with my Jeez. passive perception? <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. Uh, what is your passive perception? 
My passive perception is 17. Passive investigation is 19. 15. That is a good point. 17. Passive investigation is also 19. Or with, 18. Uh, with a 17, you can... Just looking in, into this room here, you can see at the back there is a door. Like, you, you can see how the door looks very differently shaped and colored to everything else here. Like, against the, the walls where it's like that uh, like granite, like brown granite is the, the main walls. You can see where like uh, they either did mold earth or they carved it out themselves in it and then hardened it. You can see the door is a vastly different color. You can see um, a lot of the room looks very plain. Like it l looks like your very standard empty room. There's no switches on the walls. There's no like colorings of anything with as for your check for traps you don't see anything no pressure plates no spring-loaded things no indiana jones boulder no sense fortress shenanigans no sense for fortress shenanigans no snake people no axe pendulum things it's a door that's on another animation layer yeah, we'll go with that. <laughs> totally moves. You know, I I totally forgotten passive perception was a thing because it made me remember. Oh, I've I've observed it. Yeah, I, yeah, so, I would wait. Uh, I observe it. Uh, good. <laughs> like my passive investigation is actually good. Yeah. <laughs> Looks clear to me. So now that like the big big doors right here and yep. then smaller ones on either side. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I guess we'll go out and look around then. Now that uh he can no longer hear dragons or see them, he's <laughs> a little bit less enthusiastic. Ooh, I could be mean. <laughs> could you? I could, yeah. Why would you be mean? Because warlock. Because warlock. It's true. Are there any obvious like mechanisms to make any of the doors open? Uh, you don't see any like switches or anything on the walls. You do see there is uh. There is etched in writings on the walls. Like, so, so someone carved into the walls. What language is the writing? It is in common. Oh, oh nice. Hey. Can we read the writing? You can. Do I need to make a check to read the writing? Would you like to to be safe? Yeah. Safe yeah. what? <laughs> safe <laughs> what now? <laughs> Um, what do I need to roll? In, uh, investigation or linguistic? Huh? Uh, I don't know what I need to roll. Crit one, you get a headache. <laughs> no. I Arcana? You, have, uh, I, you I actually don't, don't have to roll anything for yours. Okay. Okay. Wait. Does that well, mean someone else has to roll? Well, no, because she, because Dimitri's very book learned, so it would make sense that just naturally they'd be like, oh, this is. Oh, okay. What does Dimitri's kobold eyes see? You can see on the wall. Uh, you can see that it, it's written out in a form of almost like a journal. Entry. You can see it says uh, like XX day, XX uh, year. It counts out. Uh, it is. The third month of the of the year five hundred and seventy two. The cabin itself has been made, the trap set, the walls closed as we hide away from the armory outside. Our attempts at The various hit and runs have gone 
somewhat well, but still, head of Log's army marches about. Monsters as high as tall as buildings hide behind the mountain ways. Dragons and birds and eagles fill the skies. The place is in turmoil as we try for one last stand. And it ends there. Was so anyone else able to, to read mm -hmm. the writing? Okay, good. You said there was a date on it? Mm -hmm. It was well, the third like month of the... Five... Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Like, how long ago was the date in comparison to the current date? Your date is... Uh, let's see, 1800. You are 2,534. Would be your current date. And what was the past one again? 572. Ooh, that's a lot. Mm -hmm. Oh. Alright. How old does the writing look? Uh, it look? Worn at all? It looks worn, but it, but because it was like carved into the garnet, the, the actual like garnet infused rock, a lot of it stayed decent. Okay, so there's no indication that it's like we've traveled to a place that might be back in time or anything. Right. Uh, some of it is like kind of scarred, like uh, some of the, like just from erosion and just overall cave shenanigans. But most of it is legible. It does say that traps have been set, so I suppose we should be careful moving forward. Hmm. Yeah, we'll have to keep an eye out for that. Is there anything different on the opposite side of the room? Uh, you do see more entries. Uh, some of them are... Uh, they kind of have the same thing. They, they, they range from... Uh, this one being the, the the like final one in the room, other ones say things like uh, read out to uh, they have carved out the cave. They found safe haven here. Uh, it seems like they haven't found them yet. We have been slowly building, so uh, you can get the general idea that. Uh, whoever was here is the people that stopped chaos from being a bad thing beforehand. So you could assume that these were were the heroes before. I guess the only question now is, do we go to the left door or the right door? Um, yeah. how about we ask our guide? That's an excellent idea. Uh, Miss Defour, which direction would be the better direction to go? Mm. Well, the, that would be up to you, really. Both have uh, equal opportunities, I would say. Equal opportunities for what? Learning. Uh, oh boy. Learning traps, it, it's hard to tell. I don't entirely know what it has planned out for you. Mm. What that wasn't nice helpful. Place. I think we should flip a coin. I mean, we're already on this side. We could just start with this door. Seems as good a reason as any, honestly. I will check the door for traps. All right. Thank you. You do see a symbol on the door. Do I recognize it? Uh, it looks like a uh, an, an arcane symbol, similar to a rune. You uh, 
even with, with your passive perceptives, you know just to touch it. But it doesn't seem malicious in me. Any intent. Are there any other things that look malicious? <laughs> in fact, it looks generally clean. just looks like a... It, it's purposely a door made that only those who know how to open it can get in. Alright, well, she will try to open it. <laughs> what do you do? You said there was a rune on it? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, well, first she's gonna touch the rune. Do you, like, palm it, or do you, like, just, like, finger touch it? Uh, I just finger touch it. Alright. You see it light up. You see it start from the center. Slowly glows out. You see the rune in the middle, fully glowing. You see small symbols appear around the edges of it, like a circle. And you hear uh, the mechanism inside the wall come to life as it starts cranking so you get that like because it's you know, it, it's, been, it's been here a while and then it slowly moves that was easier than I thought it would be walk through what do I see in here? Inside, you see a stairway going up to what looks like a crank. Or a wheel. Of sorts. And there's like, just the same kind of bare room otherwise? Outside that, you do see uh, like, some like old pots. Uh, maybe some old crates and such. That's really a, about it. We check inside the pots. Alright. <laughs> now. Loop, 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 loop. It's these ones right here? Yep. Okay. Were you, were you saying something, Kate? No, I'm. Okay. I wanted to make sure we weren't like supposed to wait for you to nope. say something because it sounded like you were starting to. You're good. Okay, then, yeah, just... Oh, it's... I forgot that's a thing. Did I have message? Yeah. I want to, like, uh, take a closer look at the big turn wheel thing. Okay. Want me to, like, perception or investigation? Uh... You don't have to roll for this one. You, 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 okay. you, you, you can just see it. You can see that it looks like uh, it would probably take uh, probably one or two people to like really start getting it to turn. But you can see that it looks like it is uh, used for the doors. The ones north of us? Mm-hmm. Mm. You said you wanted to look at the pots, Dimitri? Yes. He's gonna go over and look at the pots. Uh, are they in, like, decent condition? Are they holding anything? Or uh, It looks like uh, that you can easily open them, but it looks like if, if you, like, smack them even with remote amount of strength, they'll probably break. Can you tell, like, were they put there around the same time as what the writing on the wall implied? Yeah. Okay. Very old place. Those pots have been there for a long time. Hmm. Is there any writing on the walls in here? There is. Dimitri would like to read it. Hmm. Wherever it is. It's over here. You can see it reads as thus. Turn once for secrets. Turn twice for knowledge. Turn thrice for the way ahead. Turn four if you wish to see 
Don't turn it four times. All right. You won't turn it four times, then. How many times Time should we turn it? Well, if we turn it once, we get secrets, twice for knowledge, and three times uh, if we want to open the door ahead. I'm not sure if it would imply that that's, like, if you choose one, you can't do the others or not, or if we can just turn it once and then turn it again and then turn it again. We did it five times. What do you think we have it then? How about you push it and we'll leave the room? (laughs) What if it doesn't turn more than three times? I would not like to see the land below. I mean, we're kind of here. We were told not to venture off the path. That is true. Is this not the path? It is on the path. path. How about once we get the door open, then you guys can stay in here and, and spin it one more time to see just what happens. Yeah, I'm not interested in seeing that, but if y'all want to do it after we have the door open, go ahead. In the meantime, we can turn it at least once, and it should be fine. Hey, but what if that takes us off the path? It's for secrets. I'm I'm going to start pushing it to turn it. Okay. So say turn it or don't turn it. Come on. <laughs> Do something. <laughs> you could also do something. Mm, yeah, like no. you're the only person turning this. My strength stat modifier is a negative. <laughs> Looks at yeah, your arm. Fine. <laughs> so yours is a neg? Yeah, yeah a I have a minus one. one. Yeah. <laughs> I'll use I, got, I, got eight, I got eight strength. Mage I got eight strength. Okay, it was just a negative modifier. Mage hand is like all of 10 pounds. Full of no, I know. It shit. won't help at all. But Tina's going to cast Mage hand and push with you. <laughs> Again, who doesn't have a negative modifier? Uh, you. You. <laughs> Am I the only person? I think so. Wait, does Lyndon? He also has eight strength. Oh Let's my go. gosh, the poor, can the poor helper push? We all need to go to gym <laughs> class, apparently. Jesus Christ. Apparently. You really think a sorcerer needs to dump anything but strength? Apparently, <laughs> Letty only does leg day. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, it's to run away, right? Exactly. How else uh, am I going to shoot my bow? Up? Why would I do that up close? Give me, give me the athletics. I'll help out to you. I don't know. You know what? Can I just roll with advantage since I'm having help? Yeah, go ahead. He'll he'll stand on one side, but he's uh he's negative. Lyndon sees Teeny help (sighs) and then he might as well help. Hey, let's go. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. (laughs) For the record, I think this is a bad idea. Can I can I try? Can I try? Here, oh, I'll, roll. It's acrobatics, right? I'll roll with Lyndon's help too. We got this. Holy <laughs> shit. Right? Here's, a, here's, here's acrobatics. I kind of want to see what <laughs> happened here. See, what? Did I just have done acrobatics? Correctly? I'm good at acrobatics. Was it acrobatics or? No, it was no, supposed it to be athletics. athletics. It was athletics. Okay, my bad. I was like, wait, I shouldn't have a positive in that. Okay. Here's athletics. My rolls have been bad. It was silly's out. Hey, yo. All right. <laughs> With the combined help, you guys, you know, you, like, dig your feet in. You start pushing on the large, like, paddles of, of the crank. And it takes a bit. But you start hearing the, the it grind. And it turns. For one turn. Or however many turns you want. Just one for now, if that's okay. Okay. I want secrets. Cat's just over there doing nothing. She's examining her nails. Can you at least stand by Depor to make sure she's not sketchy? She's just sitting on the ledge there, like... Not pushing on the wheel. Is she just in a ledger, like, just like... Did you ask her to? Swinging her legs. She's a theater kid, of course she's not gonna. 
She's just gonna watch us. Don't worry about it. <laughs> no, no, I'll supervise. Go ahead. All right. It turns. As you see it turn this way, you see the crank begin to grind to a, to a halt as you do your first turn. The door opens. Oh, the door up here? The door up here opens. I thought it needed three turns to open. I suppose the secrets are through there. Maybe it opens a different door on the third turn? Maybe. I wonder if it three turns opens that big door. Maybe. Or it could open the other door. We didn't test the one on the right. This is true. Are there any traps in here? I don't know. Linden walks in there. Anyways. Hmm? You walk in. The entire room starts to laugh at you. <laughs> what kind of laugh? Like a mimic. Uh, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing happens. You see in the cubby holes of the cave, there are various documents written pamphlets, uh, paperback books that have no hardcover. <laughs> so how deteriorated are these? Most of them are not in the best shape. Some are legible. I'm not in the center here on this little, uh, table platform thing. You see a map. A map of the world. Like the world as it currently is, or? The way it used to be. Cool. Oh, so How, uh, what kind of shape is this map in? Would it survive being carefully gathered up and put in my bag? So it's, <clears throat> it's not so much a, a paperback map. It is a geological, the ge it's a geo map etched into the table. Oh, okay. I just, I saw the yeah, yeah. like paper spread out and I assumed that was the map. So you can see, um, during this time, you actually do see where your cities that you currently have lived in would be. Oh. So you can see where Otaga is. You can see where Prague is. You can see where the school uh, would have been. What, what you also see in the center of the map is a giant crater. Hmm, that's interesting. Does anyone have, like... A big sheet of paper we could use to take, like, a rubbing of this map? Um, with Dimitri's bard uh, stuff, he should have some parchment, at least. Yeah, I should also, and I was actually going to take one as well. Yeah, okay. if we can, like, pool our paper, essentially, and take a rubbing of this map, or at least the important bits, mm -hmm. and just, like, make notations on the edges for how they match up with each other. Charcoal it. Yeah. That's right. what Dimitri's doing. He said he back off the table. I just, I, just ima I just imagine the shorter ones are just jumping up onto the table. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what he did. He was kneeling over it, got his little charcoal. And we both hop up and we're rubbing the charcoal. He hops back down. He'd like to examine the walls. Right. What kind of books can he see without having to touch anything? Um, it looks like uh, they were trying to save what um, various forms of like uh, old hi 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 history. So like uh, old recipes, uh, various old uh, what, what can be described as, like, family trees and such. 
if he'd touch any of these pages without, like, totally destroying them. You do have mending, don't you? Uh, yes, he does. You can use it once as an action. <laughs> Better make it count. <laughs> well, it's from his background. He didn't take the mending cantrip because that would seem kind of silly. To have his background and that double up. But, uh... <laughs> um, actually, wait. yeah, is there like anyone that particularly stands out to him that he would like be called to pick up? Mm. A lot of it is uh, kings or rulers or people that were important that uh, had benefited through like knowledge or helped get to the point they're at now. And uh, the biggest thing that you can point out is that there is a family tree for the actual villain. The what? The actual villain. Or like the, the evil dragon? The catablog. A cat blog? Catablog. Oh. Oh. So that's the one that would probably really call out to him? Mm -hmm. You can see that there's only two on there. You see him, and then uh, what would look like parents. And then you see one other. However, it is blacked out. Uh, Dimitri's going to cast Mending on it real quick just to make sure he's not going to destroy it. Mm -hmm. um... And then he will take that one to see if maybe he can find a way to unblack out the other face. Or name. Alright. Wait, did anyone else want to investigate the room anymore? Or are we good to go? They might have a chicken noodle recipe in here. Oh, dang, I don't want no one. chicken noodles. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, Dimitri can make you chicken noodle soup. I can't I eat it so. anyway. <laughs> Why not? I was thinking about that. That means you can't eat my little treats. It's true. That is correct. Which is really yeah. sad. <laughs> So the one person that would really benefit from the health buff <laughs> can't have it. Can Dimitri do research into making, like, blood-based treats? You could, yes. In okay, fact, uh, so... like, you can even ask one of the teachers there, because they like the, like how I had, like how uh, uh, Teeny actually went to the teacher. They, they, they do help do that. There are, there are students that are uh, blood- aversion so they do make uh treats and stuff food that is uh mostly blood but like steak type stuff nice if it ever comes up uh dimitri will look into it whenever teeny brings it up because at this point i don't think he knows yeah i don't think yeah i don't think i've told anybody yet except for the teacher yeah mm -hmm. but yeah, all, yeah. The, all the students are just we clueless about each other yeah. Hey, uh, Lyndon, you might want to step out of there in case us turning this makes it close again. No, we should start. We're good. 
<laughs> Don't worry, I totally wasn't uh, out of my head. I'm glad that you're in your head. Yeah, exactly. I assume we have to do another athletics check, or yes. does it turn more easily now that we've turned it once? Well, you did stop, so it... Uh... Okay. All right. Dimitri's not going to and Dimitri's not really contributing wow. much. <laughs> oh, did I do did I do acrobatics again? Hold on, let me do you athletics. Sure did. How am I getting? Bro, so I don't. It's automatically come, set to I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna fucking come and do some shit. Oh, okay, please. he still didn't. Oh my god, a, please. That would be a nine. Yeah, we need an adult. <laughs> Does no, that would be a ten because you there have we, a, holy shit. Of all trades. So well, that's, well, that, well, that's that, why it's balanced. Well, that was a net twenty. That was. Dang. Damn. Marco actually doing something for once. Hell yeah. When she wants to do something, she'll actually like do it well, but evidently. Dang, getting her to move. All right. How many times do you turn it? Once. One, yeah, one more. One more. When I okay. get to the two total turns. Okay. You turn it once more. You hear the cave again shake as another mechanism kicks on and you see from across the room this opens uh i missed it what what opens oh, oh the door. Door. okay oh okay. oh let's go explore the door dimitri on the is... other side of the uh yep. dimitri is very invested in finding knowledge did the uh knowledge. door to the north of that room close when we turned it again it did okay are we, anybody... are we, wait, hold on, hold on. Do we want to trap check? Yeah, that's what I was gonna yeah, ask. Yeah, I can trap check. Who has oh, me I'm selected? You too. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Cold person. Amazing. <laughs> All right, where's the set? We're uh, magically it's... linked, and every time you take a step forward, it just scoots me forward a foot. <laughs> oh no! A trickery. That's a uh, twenty-eight. Dang. What I say, Watson, it uh, clears the heat. Nothing, nothing is in fact in here, Holmes. There's absolutely no traps here. <laughs> Excellent. None? Not a one? Wow. Incredible. In this entire room. Uh, what's in the pots? What's in the pots? Um, you want to know? Yes. Should I roll? One has a... Uh what looks like gray water like uh like the parts of the pot had kind of like gotten into the water supply yeah. for them uh one has pickles those are some rough pickles man they've been uh, no. in here for like no <laughs> actually like 2000 years actually they <laughs> look, the endless pickles are actually they look like they're like a fine wine they're still good did you announce come back to for the those. party that there are pickles? Uh, he'd come over and say, there's something that looks like pickles in those jars over there. But then he'd keep walking. Is looks this like door open? or is? I don't know. The is rabbit door goes open? against pickles. <laughs> hey, is the door open? Is this door open? The door's not open. Remember, Letty, that's a war crime. What, pickles? No, you know exactly what I mean. <laughs> That's a war crime. Don't worry, it's not going to happen. It might happen. Is there <laughs> any more wall writing in this area? There is. You see, Ooh. on the wall it says, Turn once to find supplies. Turn twice to open the way. Turn thrice and what you find may shock the mind. I want to turn it three times. I really I don't do want to get a mind spike, times. man. I really don't want a mind spike. But I really do. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't. You're lucky I have uh, noodle arms. So this door is closed to us right now, right? Yeah. 
and it was mm. turn once for once supplies, supplies, twice for the new way, and then three times it's something else. Shock the mind. Yeah. All right, I guess go let's go it. turn it the once and see how it goes. My familiar is going to assist me. God, I hope so, because you guys are going to shit. We really aren't doing so hot with these athletics checks. I guess. All right, I'll actually roll the correct one this time. I did it. Oh, man. I think a seven <laughs> is the highest I've rolled yet. <laughs> You just need to roll an eighteen. It's fine. You just see, <laughs> du, you just see Dimitri walk up like just, just flex. You see, see the shirt break. No, actually working against <laughs> yeah. us. Like Where do you work out? The library. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? I cast fist. Damn. All right. Um. Do we want to go once for supplies, or...? Let, let's go once, and then yeah. we can go again to open that door. Okay. Alright. You turn it once, like before, you hear the gear is beginning to bend. And the door opens. This one? Yep. Hey. Sorry, the map is so big, it's hard to find it, it, Yeah, no, it's fine. <laughs> Here, I can actually just do this. It's, it's gonna kick, kick you out, but it'll... Oh, it's not good. There you go. Ah! Okay, there that's... Yeah. Bro! Thank you. Nice. Um, what does, what does Dimitri see in the supply room? Inside. You see various, uh, what looks like weapons. Like, they, uh... Use this as a like a supply cache for weapons, bows. You can see some armors that have kind of rusted, uh, rusted away. You can see uh, stacks of arrows. What looks like uh, various amounts of ingredients for spells. Um, Anything look to be in good condition? Most of the ingredients are, like, some of the roots for trees don't really ever go bad. Um, various spell components don't really ever turn bad. So a lot of those you, you can grab. Okay. I will grab those, and then I will start ritual casting to tech magic. And then going to pick up an arrow from whatever quiver or stockpile there are and look for quality. Okay. Are there any, like, books or anything in here? There are books. Can Dimitri know what the books are? No mega wall. You could say they, uh... They are written in a very funny language. Almost like... Limericks. Would you like to... Investigate. Yeah. You need an investigation check. Oh, that was a bad investigation check. Well, you didn't fail. But you do notice that uh, some of the words uh, seem to spell stuff out subtly. You're just not sure what yet. Can can he can he take it without it, take it deteriorating? He can take it. As for arrows, right. uh, Letty, you can find that um, probably about let's say thirty out of like the huge bundles here are usable. Like they won't snap when they're pulled back. They won't uh, break. All right, he'll yoink those so he doesn't have to enchant his bow. Mm -hmm. Any, like, uh, what other weapons? Are there any, like, daggers and stuff? 
there are daggers, there are long swords, uh, great swords. There are armors here, but they're not in the best condition. Anything, any cool looking daggers? There's one. Okay, he's gonna go and pick it up and then look at it, and then he's gonna, you know, go over here and like, hey, teeny. He looks I, up at you, but continues doing the ritual. I uh, I I found this, and I think you might want to have it. And I'll hand, try to hand over the dagger. It looks pretty cool. I think you might like it. Oh, uh, sure. She'll just take it and pocket it, and continue the ritual. Gonna... You're blocking the doorway, Dimitri yeah. can't get out. <laughs> He's gonna make sure you're still in here for this cringe as he continues on. He just wants to leave. He got his book. He's happy. I want out. I don't want to be part of this drama. Free him. Besides seeing the angsty couple. <laughs> uh, well, okay. He'll just Free. smile for a second and then uh, read the room and I'll just go back to look at stuff. Okay. It'll just so, be over um, here, uh, sweating and self doubting. <laughs> yeah, it's like you've been <laughs> left on read. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, yo, you got that, that teenage anxiety. He just wrote a paragraph and got K as a response, right? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Period. Uh, as you do get off, uh, detect magic. One. Uh, uh, one. You do find the dagger in your pocket. Does uh, go beep beep beep. Oh. And two. So I'm not done with this folder, and God knows how long. You find a wand. Ooh. However, the wand uh, looks like uh, the hilt of what seems like some kind of sword or dagger. So you can see that it looks like it's made of silver. Uh, you can see on the pommel there is a green jewel. And then from the guard, about, I'd say, five or so inches up, uh, you see, like, a encased crystal to okay. where, like, the hill would still go up on a blade if there was one. He will take it and pocket it for now to identify later. Because I don't want to sit here and cast identify twice, because that would take <laughs> effectively a half hour. You just plow slot, you nerd. Uh, I don't have it prepared, so no. Oh, fucking <laughs> rip. It's Is also why I ritual detect magic. Is there anything in this room in particular, like over here, or nope. like anything new? Outside of the writing and what looks like uh, someone, uh, people may have possibly slept in here. Like, you can see where uh, beds may have been, or cots, or any type of, like, uh, makeshift bettery may have been. Uh, Tini is going to keep looking around for magic as she goes around now. Are the pickles so, pinging? Uh, are they magical? <sighs> or Theo the, thinks they're magical. Are are the are the pickles pinging is magical? Yes. Nice. Oh, magically <laughs> delicious. <laughs> what, what kind of magic? Uh like someone went to great uh, extent to make sure that barrel itself or, or that jar itself purposely kept the pickles nice always good is it just for the pickles like yep. does it does it break once it is <laughs> ultimate nope. 
Are you confirming that Zret and Skedmerk are in this world? No, I'm confirming that war crimes do happen and have good causes. <laughs> my, my question is, if we took out the pickles and replaced them with something else, would the jar keep them preserved? Yeah, like a body. Well, no. I wasn't really thinking a body. It's just a jar. No. In jars now? I mean, like... I don't know what I meant, but like I'm it has potential for something. Real shit. You don't know yet. You'll have to find out. Okay. All right, we're taking the jar too. <laughs> I mean, I thought we already were. <laughs> we can take that on the way back. <laughs> Are you gonna get pickles at all? <laughs> Turn the thing again, I guess. We well, get a figure who put it in there. No. What do you mean? <laughs> you know exactly what I mean. No, I don't. Can you explain it to me? I'm not going to. <laughs> oh, wow. Good roll. Skill check. Hello? Oh, there I am. Skill check. Athletics. I'll pop off once and that's all 14. I need. And they took oh, the pickles. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be one of those things where it's like nobody this will ever whole... be tempted by this object. This they whole took thing the one makes like a logical test. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you you don't know what's happening. No one does. She's she's doing this all mentally. Oh fuck! Not this is actually just. A... No, I like to imagine she's just like pulling out a flip phone and like typing super quick and then shutting it again. Oh, we take is their very uh. The fuck is it? The mixed briar test, but in the form of like a dungeon. She she's she is a hundred percent like everything you guys do. She's like, huh? No, this is no, it's this kind of group. Oh shit! They're taking you things. Mean, of course, I'm preserve, taking things. Preserve history. Preserve history. And you guys are just looking to preserve, I guess. Yeah. All right. I mean, we sure are. All right. For anything you, that'll help my arcane research. You guys turn it one more time. The door opens. All Which right, should be. Or... Oh. Sure. Uh, with the turn of this one, both of these solid rocks it goes this way and it goes this way. Ah. Making a path up into here. Wait, but then what about what the other to... one did? I'm guessing did that it... there are more doors later on that we'll need to turn that one for. Do we want to go ahead and turn it just to have it turned? Um, may as well. There's nothing else of interest in here, probably. So, if this door closes, I don't think we'd be missing anything because there's only the thing that shocks the mind left. Yeah. And uh, if it's a mind spike, I cry. So, mind sliver. Mind sliver. Yep. Brain hurdy. Mind sliver. Make brain hurty. Brain hurt. All right. Let's go. Um, skill check. Athletics. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Very nice. You just like pick up the entire thing and flip it around. Y'all don't even have to push. I just like. You just kick it. I'm focused. Your tail twitches. A little chitter. All right. He clicks. Yeah. All right. Okay, but what if we turn it one more time? If you Give want me to one turn moment, it again, feel free. But I'm leaving. Okay, go ahead. Oh no, I'm getting out of the room. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does I'm it. With him. Oh, oh my oh, god! No. He does. <laughs> Looking with through the, the door. Yeah. You sure? Does it budge? Wait, how far is he? Yeah, it moves. Yeah, he turns it one more time. What happened? So I see it start to move. I'm gonna cast Vortex Warp. Fuck! <laughs> he is now... I don't know. I get to pick. Oh. Well, you... <laughs> Remember, Letty, get... What? You get to choose to fail. Oh, you can choose to resist it if you want to. Oh. Uh, he wouldn't have been paying attention to those. Alright. anything happen or is it did it not complete its cycle yeah, is it still spinning oh, what happened it, 
it spins all the way. You see the entire room light up. The door shuts. The door shuts? Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Well, no. This door shuts. Yeah. Hmm. Don't like that. We just unintentionally missed a uh, realm warp. Intentionally. 80% yeah, yeah, what are you talking about? Unintentional. <laughs> intentionally. I very missed. intentionally missed that. I very yeah. intentionally did not want any of that. Yeah, let's not any percent Tartarus, please. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just get launched to the lowest level. Oh, whatever. The bunny's going to keep eating, eating pickles. Did she note that down, too? You don't know? I would like to perceive. All right. You walk into the room, you can see r running water all through here, and you can see it uh, water falling into the nothingness below. Is there any writing? There is. What's it say? On the walls, it says <laughs> to find your answer. Turn once. See those above. Turn twice. And to open the door, turn twice. To find your answer, turn once. To see those above, turn twice. So That's those <laughs> above, is that like Angels? I don't like, or yeah, is I don't it like the, the rest of, of the that. school? <laughs> we about to get sent to heaven? What the fuck? <laughs> Got a turn to find out? Well, we can start with once, because once what? seems safe. And then it yeah. looks in the water. You can see all the way down to the bottom. Uh, you can see, like, there, there, there is a bottom to the type, this little platform. Then there are fish in here. Oh. Fish. Mm -hmm. Fish. What kind of fish? fish? Uh, Anybody have a fishing pole? Probably like your standard like tuna or trout or, or kind of like that. N nothing too big. N n nothing like, oh god, here's a 300 pound tuna. How close to the surface are they? Uh, some, some you can see like jumping up out of the water. Some are like just probably about a couple arms down. So none of them jumping high enough, or the water's not high enough for, like, to reach the surface of the water. Uh, it's about a couple inches from, uh, like, like if you stand here, like there's at least like a couple inches where the water is still down. Oh, okay. okay. So it's not like the water is right up, up on you. There's you, you still have that like safety net of like. A uh, couple inches before the water even really gets to you. And it's going to pull out an arrow and uh, touch it to the water. It's water. Can can I try to use my claws to catch a fish as it jumps? You could. Give me a... Uh... Oh, would that be just an unarmed strike or an acrobatics check? Or... Give me an acrobatics Would you like me to just Eldritch Blast the fish for you? I was thinking about doing that exact same thing. I... Cannot believe you're trying to redneck this. Hell yeah, brother. Let's, hey, Dota. let's throw some dynamite in them waters. Bro, I live in Arkansas. <laughs> He's using Tanner, right? Throw some I dynamite in them waters. Oh shit, did you catch one? Fishing with hand grenades. With an 18, you managed to catch one, yeah. What kind of fish did I catch? Uh... With a bass. Ooh. With a bass. Oh. Oh, oh shit. Oh, at the bass? Ooh. He's got moves. He's got moves. Yo, he's slapping it. He's seeing. <laughs> he's just imagining a little fish sized bass. <laughs> he's he's goaded with the sauce. There you go. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, quirked up white boy. <laughs> Busting it down sexual style. Right, no, you catch a uh, bass. It's about. 
I'd say enough that that it, like if you heat it up, you could actually feed yourself. Or seeing that Lennon Lennon's gonna get on a knee and uh, gonna get out his crossbow. And he's gonna wait for another fish to pop up, and we'll take a shot when everyone does. Erica would like to blast the fish oh before you can shoot it. Is it like clearly just a normal fish? There's yeah. nothing weird yeah. or magical about it. Looks like just a normal fish. Is the tech magic still on? Yeah. Yeah. It, it looks like a normal fish that you'd get in like a, a lake. What happens that if we put cool. it in the pickle jar? That's an excellent <laughs> question. So you so you don't want to see what happens when we turn the wheel, Walmart, but you want to fuck around with the pickles? Not particularly. I just am curious as a <laughs> as a player. <laughs> As Dimitri, Dimitri <laughs> probably doesn't want to mess with the pickles. They've been I, in there for a while. I can't believe I have to add a, a, a war crime of don't put fish in pickles. But <laughs> well, pickled who fish. said we were it's putting it with the pickles? We could take the yeah. pickles out and eat them and put the fish in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this poor fish! Hey, can we spend about an hour doing that, replacing pickles with fish? No, <laughs> no, you cannot. <laughs> can we make our own currency again? No. <laughs> no. I'm Pitka. telling you, it was it was possible. <laughs> it was so possible. It I was could, I could one go the story again if you it want. It was one gold. Like you sounded like a fucking crypto bro. It on was that day. one gold, you fucking mongrel. You were gonna make me pay two extra gold to stand it in because it was goblin gold. Because of the fact that I outsmarted you and you gave us inspiration for it. Imagine. Putting economy in your game and your players bitching. All right, Amazing. we're about to we're about to no. do real, real quick. No, right, so what ended up happening is we went to a uh, beast man city, uh, and what ended up happening is uh, just before that we were at a goblin village, and we got a bunch of gold for them, but it was all printed as goblin gold. There's like a hobgoblin's face on it. So we go to the beast man village and it was like, hey, let's go stay at an inn, right? So so we go to like the first cheapest end we could find, and uh, uh, we went to go get rooms. And it said, "Hey, it's gonna be like three gold." And we were like, "Oh, okay." Uh, but before we made the transaction, somebody else came in, purchased a room, and they only paid one gold with the beast man uh, gold. So I'm like, "Oh, fuck this!" I asked, "Hey, how much gold is in uh, like actual gold is in the goblin gold versus the beast man gold?" So. We found that out, figured it was the same ratio. So I was just like, hey, let's just remint this gold because we had an artificer and uh, a, a fucking fire genasi. So as we were getting ready to mint our own, own gold of goblin gold into the beastmen gold, uh, the god said no. I mean, we the... spent like 30 minutes discussing how we were going to do it, too. We did. You yeah. could do it, but I'm pretty sure that it'll also get like Beastman IRS on your ass for minting new money without permission. It's okay. We were stealing his face, their champion's face anyway, and he was it's, already it's... dead. It didn't fucking matter. It's not <laughs> we right. Gonna because leave the we planet to anyway. A, we talked to a little, uh, a local blacksmith who was a Luxodon, and he totally uh, cleared us for this. We could have done it. Yeah. Mind you, this entire plan was coming from a little short goblin uh, that could only be uh, understood by saying, "Hi, I'm Billy." Hi, I'm Billy. I I had to oh, cast Billy. tongues. Yeah, yeah, I, I had Billy. to cast tongues <laughs> as in drama to, to translate yep. the entire time. Okay. It's like well, an I am Groot situation. It was fantastic. I would like to gut and clean the fish and just keep the meat and like wrap that up in a cloth for later. Okay. Put in the pickle jar. I'm not gonna put it in the pickle jar. We can totally do it though. I'm like going to taint my sashimi with your dang pickles and pickle juice. So how's this situation going? Are there any fish jumping up? Well, you have to make an attack because the second you make an attack, she's gonna make an attack. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but I make my attack with the gat. Okay. Fourteen. You know, I'm feeling like I should silvery barbs you. You don't have silvery you don't barbs. Don't have silvery barbs. Oh. I know. No. Kate told me I could take it though. Oh no, she does. However, why did she? However, do that? <laughs> however, she forgets 
that this it means everything uh, else has to <laughs> That if you now can I do have it, to take this fucking spell. Hell yeah, let's go, Chief. Fuck. Dimitri's lined up at the wheel. Yep. I am yeah. also at the wheel. Speaking you want to just try and push her uh, while they're faffing it out? Jerry is gonna climb up on Cecilia and help action. Do I want to be mean to Letty? Is that is the issue here? Okay. Absolutely. Get silver barbs nerd. Fire rat on your shoulder now. I just got to reroll. Yeah. Skill check. Wow, thanks, buddy. Wow. You helped me out so much. Yeah, but you still got to take the 14. 14 what? Your attack is 14. Oh, yeah. That's still probably going to hit a fish. Yeah, no, I get advantage. Uh, 17 and 14. It turns. How many times do you want to turn it? Jeez. Um, we just wanted to go once first, right? All that. Yeah. yeah. And uh, you're still a loser. <laughs> wait, did we want to go once? It was see those above, right? Oh, no, that was find your answer. Let's barbs? turn once. Okay, okay, so. Because well, this is the first time we've turned it at all, right? Yep. Yeah. Turn once okay. was we find the answer to the question. Isn't turn twice was secrets above. Or something above. No, it's not. And the third one's open the door. Mm -hmm. Unhide your token, nerd. Wait, is it, wait, no, put that spell tone back down right now. We can't see I your token. Shit. Okay, cat's hand. Token? I can see oh. Cat's token. Oh, no, you, you can see it, but you can't see oh, it. Oh, no, he, want, he wants to see all my shit. Yeah. Let's just do, like, the health bar. I want to snoop. Ah, okay. Alright, so you turn, turn it once or three? Mm -hmm. Just just once right now. We want to see okay. the answer to the question. Do we even know the question? Oh. Nope. So we can work we're about to know the answer. The answer. <laughs> it's, right. a, it's gonna be one of the what's the answer to the life, the universe, and everything. 42. What was the question? What, why is that the answer? It's Wait, just I have it? I need to, uh, a PNG of this. I beat. Why is uh, here? I beat Cat's attack by one, by the way. You did. You did get a fish that's now hooked onto the wall. Sweet. He did have it. Let's fucking go. He'd be picking up what kind of fish it'd be. It's also a bass with a base. Nice. Does it got a little bit of swag? It does not have swag. Oh no. Cringe. <laughs> you got a cringe fish. It's fucking cringe, bro. Mm, don't mind me. Cringe fish for your fail meal. <laughs> what? What? Why is he here? Hello? I can't Hello? remember his name, a but why Aku -Aku? is this dude here? Aku -Aku? Yeah, thank you. Why are you here, Aku Aku? You see a floating spiritual head appear over the over the gear you can see around it uh it looks like uh it looks like an actual detached head almost that's floating and he goes Rolling once, quite the choice. Rolling twice would have been better. The wording was a bit ambiguous, to be completely honest. Do you respond? Do what? Does he respond to what he just said? Of does he respond? To what? A poison. Does he does he answer mm. questions? Yes, he answers questions. Look in your first level spells. There you go. Hey, what happens? Uh, uh, in that other room, if we turn the wheel four times, <laughs> are you sure? I can't you take want it yet. Well, one, uh, you only kind of did it. No. Oh, only one no. answer. <laughs> That's is also not an one answer for the whole group. Well, it is my job to administer your test, but I can only answer one question. Interesting. Only one question can be answered. How do I get to the gym? No. 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 <laughs> Damn it. We're pushing you in the water with the fishes. 
go fucking swim in the vision. Well, if only one question can be answered, we can't ask him his name or where this place came from or what happened to the and people that were we here or do we have to, like, we can't ask any of those questions. Hey, what's the answer to the test? <sighs> we don't even know what the test is. But if we have the answer, then it doesn't matter. Yeah, it does you matter because uh, we have to, uh, backwards the, the equation. <laughs> Reverse engineer it. It wasn't yeah. a math test. Yeah, it was backwards from the answer. Yeah. It wasn't a math test. This isn't algebra. What color shirt is the other guard wearing? Stop it. Shut up. Stop it. Do you. He can give you the answer, but it is not the. Mm. He can give the answer, but. Never said that it would be honest if he gave the answer either. Right. Oh, shit, we do have to ask what color should the other guards wearing. No, you don't. There isn't There's another guard. guard. <laughs> uh, has the guards responded a little bit to just chitter chatter, right? Like little mm -hmm. conversation. Mm -hmm. He he, he'll stay here as long as you don't answer your question. He'll. He'll talk to you, he just won't. But the end, you answer your question, you're... Gotcha. Gotcha. What if we just turn the, the wheel again? While he's there? That's rude! <laughs> Do we want to offer him a pickle? I mean, we can. You think he'd eat the pickle? Oh. You want a pickle? <laughs> no, that's a question! That's not a question! <laughs> that's not a question! <laughs> That's just a question. Okay. We are offering you a pickle, should you so desire. So that's three for poison, and uh, poison will uh, unfortunately be a pick of Tuesday. You knew it was a war crime. Help it. You knew it was a war crime. Couldn't help it. I could derail a gun and tell that story. No. <laughs> uh, we'll have to save it for later because I am confusion. Me as well. well we don't but, really uh, have a question right now. We're offering you a pickle, should you so desire, or a fish. I, I do not eat. You sure? Oh, then, then our pickle's I, really good. Don't Can't don't ask questions. Choose not to, maybe. Mm. Well, that's too bad. I suppose he doesn't want to pickle. Okay, fair enough. Does he correct me? No. Okay. I don't think we have a question right now. How do we become the Elden Lord? You stop that. <laughs> <laughs> Literally going to push push her into the water and see if she falls off the edge. Oh god. <laughs> I can answer your first question if you wish to know the answer to the, to the trial. But see, we don't know the question for you the trial, so having the, the answer question. doesn't always work. Because there can be multiple questions that have the same answer. Hey, how do we pass your test? Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how do we pass the test? Stop it. It's a valid question. I mean, it's not a bad no, question. No questions have been asked yet, though. We don't want him to disappear until we have a valid reason. I mean, that's why I wanted to push the wheel some more, because <laughs> we, we don't. We might find the question that needs to be answered in one of the yeah. other rooms, and we have to it, do but, three turns to well, open we the don't doors. Know, we don't know if we can turn the wheel back after we've done it. I mean, do we read the question if we turn it again and then we have the answer already? <laughs> Wait, what, uh, Debor, we can ask you questions without you disappearing. Is this guy your friend? No. Ah, uh, who is he? He is the guardian that will take you to your test. Ah, uh, what was uh what was the question? 
The question is in the test. Ah. So he'll take us to the test. Yes. We'll have the answer, but we won't have the actual question. So there's a potential for multiple questions. No, but no, no. no. If takes us to the test, then we will have the question. No, no, no. Remember what I said. He will not disappear until you ask him the question for the answer. Okay, oh, okay. So, then we can, so we can go ahead and continue to the to the test. Exactly. Okay. Oh, okay. So let's not... Why did you give him a hat? <laughs> oh my god. I'm in fear of fish. All because you got the fish? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, um, I guess we can start turning. We want to turn it. Let's see. More for the one more time guy. to see above, and then a time after that to open the doors. Right. Yep. Yeah. Am I still receiving assistance from the creature? Yes, you are. Creature. The creature. All right, are we returning it once or three times? I'd say once to see just if we can one. do the see above, and then it's if not, just turn it a third time. Yeah, we should see what's above. Do what, cat? I said it fits too well. It does. Why did I it still really roll does. better than you? Why Why did I roll better than you? Because my rolls are being really weird. You have assistance. Being finished, sure he is suffering. <laughs> this is life. All right. <laughs> You turn it, what, what's more? And you see the entire place begin to shift and change. And you find yourself Here. Find yourself here. Uh, what? And then you go grab. Mm, pixels. Do, do any of us recognize this place? You stand in the midst of a village in front of you. A crowd is in front. Many of people. And in front of that crowd, you see a woman with her head in a guillotine and an executioner oh. next to her. Behind them, you see the king and the queen of the nation wearing black as they're mourning you. The entire area is currently black and white like you were frozen in time, similar to how you were in the classroom. Oh. Can Dimitri roll a history check, or would he already know kind of what this scene is representing? You actually don't know anything about, about this just yet. Hmm. Okay. See him kind of front and center and go, No. This is your first try. This entire town has information scattered about about what happened, what's the going-ons. However, it is missing vital information that you yourself must put together. Once you have gotten the information, simply call upon me and we will start the trial. Or the start the finale of it. We could just ask him what the information is. 
It would There's be a, a lot chance easier. that that wouldn't actually solve the trial. I'm pretty sure the trial itself is to actually gather the information ourselves. We can we ask should... him what would happen if we asked that question. We should save our question. I agree. <laughs> So, do we want to split up and see if we can speak to people, or I can uh, try to attract people here? I don't know if these people will respond to us. Uh, are the people moving, or are they no, frozen? You are currently frozen time. Or the, they're mm, so they probably time. can't. They can't respond to us or see us, or probably. Nope. The clues, the clues are in the houses. Oh, nice. They're just going to rob them. I don't think up is a good idea. Or, or it's not that they're in the houses, they are spread across, uh, about the town. About the entire town? Not all of it. You don't have to like go everywhere if you don't want to. We should probably try to stick together. I agree. So I guess um, we can start with one of these three houses right off the square. It's always this one. Time to do a little beanie. <laughs> Doors open. It breaks the window you... anyway. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Bob. The door's open. Breaks window. But I want to break um, the window. Anything with uh, po uh, passive? Anything passive? Investigation or perception? All yeah. Right. You get your first uh, set of information. Ooh. A king. Would it be? Uh, a king and a queen have a child. That child gains the rule to right, or gains the right to rule. However, those behind the scenes have ulterior motives. When the boy himself could come of age. That's your first bit. What was the last part of it? When the boy can what? Come of age. age. Oh, when he can come of age. Okay. Okay. Got that written down. I don't have anything to write with. Meanwhile, while you're doing that, you see the poor and the master kind of like down on the on ice cream on a bench. Oh, sick. I want ice cream. He eats ice cream, but he won't eat my pickle. <laughs> <laughs> they do know we can hear them, right? Apparently not. I wasn't in character. Well, it was, but it was in threat character. <laughs> Alright, so there's nothing else to find inside of their house, right? Nope. As you walk in, you can see the scene itself. Uh, like, the Questions themselves are kind of like, um, kind of, kind of like those puzzles you see in like uh, Resident Evil Seven. We had to uh, maneuver the bird so that it would match the picture. When you walk in, oh, the shadow puzzle. Yeah, like when you walk in, the question is sprawled out in in similar in in that way in the in environment. So you have to kind of like stand in the right place to be able to see it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Dimitri uh... will kind of weave through the crowd, and you said that there was like a king and queen. Where were they? So the I just do this. Uh, so so the crowd would be uh, here. The guillotine and the woman and the executioner are. Here, and the king and queen are kind of like on a table with guards back here. Gotcha. Okay. He'll kind of weave through. Does he see anything at with the person at the guillotine? All you see is a woman. She looks about, let's say, about twenty-two ish. Uh, short blonde hair. She looks like she's a uh, has like a. Uh, Worker's outfit, like she has like uh, clothes that would seem like someone who works, but they're not 
royalty of the rich. Very uh citizen getting. Just like That's average true. person kind of yeah, clothes. Yeah. And she will make oh, you go ahead. Sorry. She's not someone any of us would like recognize. No, she she, she looks like your uh, average Jane. He is going to investigate the king and queen, see if anything's up with them. You see the queen is wearing a black dress. She has a veil over her face like she is in mourning. Like somebody had died. Does the king have a crown on? He does have a crown. Can I take the crown off? You cannot. You cannot Damn. just disturb the scene. Gorilla, gorilla glue. Yeah. <laughs> it's done what's, the, what's the overall mood of like the crowd and the person being executed? Because obviously the king and queen are like somber, like they're in mm -hmm. mourning, but what about the rest of them? Uh, without any like noise or anything, you can see like the person looks like they're shouting uh, that that's a, about to be killed. Uh, the crowd looks like they are in favor of. So the crowd's like pro the execution. Yes. Is the person being executed like shouting like oh, I'm about to die, or are they like angry about something? Uh, the general gist you can get with uh, like just on the expression alone would be like the look of she didn't do it. Ah. The irony with that is palpable right now, but. There you go. I guess let's go into this house then and okay. see if there's anything in there. Oh, uh, for this is just, there's no house here. This is a like oh, center all... town. Okay. Oh, okay. So, so. These are fine. Everything else out here is fine. This is like center town. Okay. Okay. Teeny is gonna like climb down the wall here instead of going all the way back to the stairs. <laughs> I'll look stairs, into stairs, 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 stairs. <laughs> all right. Now we split the party. This is how we do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. I mean, Four. I guess we could just cover more ground this way. Four yeah. Two. For Dimitri and Silly. You guys walk into the house, you kind of shift your self around, and you get the second part. You hear, or it re reads out, blood is thicker than water. However, if blood is thicker than water, what hurts more than the betrayal? To have thy own family betray you? Or thy friend. Well, the full saying is blood is thicker than, or the blood of the covenant is thicker than the water of the womb. So, the friends you make are more important than the family you were born with. Correct. Oh, there we go. There's our answer. <laughs> There's your answer for what? Oh boy! Well, we just asked the question. It asked what hurt, hurts more, being betrayed by your family or by other friends, and using the full breadth of that saying as it's supposed to be, it's the friends your would be worse. Friends, because you chose them and you gave them yeah. that opportunity. Your family, you didn't choose them. You're stuck you with them, but yeah, you didn't, you didn't really them. give them the opportunity to hurt you. They that. just kind of had it from the beginning. That is not. Uh, the... Is that what you're going to ask him, or you want more? No, no. I mean, we're, we're just, just going to keep walking. Okay. But uh, what's up with our friends down below? Teeny and Lyndon. This house. All right. <laughs> you walk in. You see inside the house as you shift about the third part. 
Oh. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna draw like a white circle on the houses we've looked at. It would have been so good if we got number two. I had a fucking thing planned for that shit. <laughs> Actually, hold on. Look straight at Lyndon and say betrayal of friend. <laughs> <laughs> oh jeez. You enter the third house as as that you shift about. The third part of it appears. Would it be? To have the dagger in thy hands. Do you press it against the heart? Even when you know it is wrong. And could lead to more dire things. I mean, that's kind of straightforward. A little ominous. <gasps> it's green. Well, what's that? Oh, it's, that's just me marking it. It's, it. <laughs> it's the clap snake's ass. Uh -huh. <laughs> that would be you breaking a fourth wall. <laughs> oh, okay. We'll leave that alone then. <laughs> but with... No walls broken. Those three... You watch as sound starts to return to the world. You hear the crowd shouting for her murder. You hear the crowd shout, Kill the witch. Kill her. Before she can taint anybody else. You hear from, from the woman, It was not me. It was not I who did such deed. You have the wrong person. And of course the boohooing of the queen and king. King and queen in the back, but. Hmm. So people in the crowd, you can hear them. Are they moving? Uh, no, you just start to hear their voices as you have one more to go. Okay. I want to look through the eyes of my familiar as they do this one. <laughs> as you two walk into the fourth house, you hear uh, not a sentence, but instead a conversation. You hear... What sounds like the uh, what sounds like a king and queen talking about their newborn child, how he will be the next in line. He will push our nation into better, prosperous areas even after we are gone. Hopefully, we have left a good enough kingdom for him. Even in our state. You get a picture of like the king and queen holding the baby. He's 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 got his hand up, he's ripping his dad's thumb. What does the baby look like? Uh he's about uh, I'd say seven pounds. He's got a full head of hair, it's like this like a brownish uh, a, a light brown, golden eyes. He's wrapped in a uh, pretty lavish silk shawl. And he pimped out. And what was the text from this one over here again? Which one? Uh, uh, the one you guys did. The text was... <laughs> To have a dagger in thy hands, do you press it against the heart even when you know it's wrong and could lead to more dire things? Kill the baby? 
No. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. God, cat. Give the baby to the bay. Friday's game. Give the baby. You're not to Titus. The Give baby to Faye. Is the baby even dead? You don't know. You have to, at this point, you now have every, everything that has been told to you. You now must make a deductive reasoning. I say we meet back up and then discuss. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Scuttle, scuttle, scuttle. Meanwhile, Tiny as, legs. as you guys do that, they have moved on to funnel cakes. Ooh, okay. where are they getting these? Thanks about asking the question. Can he have some and then decides against it? <laughs> you can ask before. <laughs> can't ask what his face. <laughs> Mr. Mask. Yeah, he, he, he could ask where DePore got it. <laughs> that is true. Me. Um, Dimitri would relay any of the information that they got pretty much word, word for word for the others. Amy would do. So, we have a grieving king and queen, townspeople in a riot over a person that's currently in the guillotine, persons being accused of witchcraft, and we have themes of betrayal in our notes. Yeah, but she claims it wasn't her. And yours mentioned a dagger, so I mean, if she's a a witch or a spellcaster, I doubt that she'd use a dagger. You Most might be right. It also says, if you knew it would cause bad things, would you do it? This is the clone Hitler argument all over again. <laughs> no, no, this is more change of the baby Hitler argument. Yeah. Yeah, she kind of is. Jesus. Jesus, too? Kill the baby. <laughs> okay. No. <laughs> Give me the knife. It's Old a rhetorical person. answer. <laughs> oh. Old person. <laughs> Hides all of my knives. <laughs> You do that that one part, that one bit where it's uh you have to, you know, toss all of your weapons down on the table, but mm -hmm. it takes you a considerable amount of time. Yeah, right. Like what the crossbow, the bow, the sword, the arrow, <laughs> like your in Sinbad. Yeah, your boot. What was the boot in there? You hit it, knife. Yeah, there's a knife in the boot too. Alright. So you have all the parts. You have the scene set. And now, we will move. Proper map for this. Proper map for this. So, uh, did you just give your familiar your new hat? He did. It will carry on the legacy of the big fish. Yeesh. I still have Jerry. Do you still have Jerry? Do you want Jerry back? Uh, not right now. You're I Jerry like now. I guess so. Um, I have not loaded in yet. Are, uh, yeah, which map are we on? Okay. On the, on the wisdom of leaving a mouse with the cat person. That sounds it's racially, racially very entertaining. <laughs> Boy, it's a very spicy mouse. That's part of why I did it, yes. Alright, you guys are Yay. here. I will use... I'm still loading in. Yeah, it's fine. Battle. I will grab Billy it to does use, say battle. The battle. I'm here. Wow. Billy will signify by the crowd. Yeah, that's some sick-ass armor. Alright. And the Queen King is back here regardless. But it's not important. We don't care about them. Yeah, it's not important. Now, oh my god. You have your clues. You oh, watch, this... you watch as the scene starts to bleed in, bleed in with 
the color. You watch as the sound be begins to intensify as you hear the crowd shouting for more uh, murder. You see the w woman, her head is in the guillotine. At any point, it could be dropped by, by the execution. You see her screaming, it wasn't her. I didn't do anything. Insert the other. Didn't do it. Wasn't me. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, I think the question we need to ask is pretty clear at this point, and it should be, did she do it? I don't think and, she did. And if she did, then we don't intervene. And if she didn't, we save her. We could also see if we can interact with these people and ask them questions. Oh, that There's is people. true. Can we ask Billy? Billy, do you know anything? Well, so... <laughs> I am Billy. He, he's, <laughs> he's more or less the entire crowd, so... Gotcha. Hi, we're any... Billy. <laughs> <That's>, uh... <laughs> uh, you cannot approach up there. Uh, at, so we can get an invisible wall. We well, no, get, or... you are at this point. The it is live. Everything is oh, happening okay. live. So the yeah, only come on. so yeah, we're so, we're do the cut scene. Like so so the most you can do is talk to the crowd. If you try and approach, they will stop you. What, what's the closest we can get before the guards stop us? You can get about here. Okay, so this is the no man's land yep. right here. So okay. Billy, or who not. is who is the lady? Yeah, what happened? You see a uh, woman about 45. Uh, she's rather old looking. She turns, she goes, she, she killed the prince. What was the prince's name? His name was Jonathan. How did she kill the prince? She killed the prince in cold blood. How? Who is she? Yeah, how did she do it, though? Give me the deets. With a dagger to the heart. Who is Why she? is everyone calling her a witch? Because only, yeah, a, because only a witch would bewitch a man's heart and then betray him. Wait, how old is, is the prince? 16. Okay, and how, how old is this lady? She looks about 45. Uh, what? Like, like Mary, the lady that's being beheaded? Oh, the, 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 uh, she's 22. Okay. I got an idea. I'm gonna message Mary. <laughs> <laughs> hey, oh, bitch, you like, do it. <laughs> blasted the executioner. I think that'd be kind of cool. Hey, us gremlins. <laughs> is this I'm where gonna... they were getting the funnel cakes from? No, this is not where they uh. get the funnel cakes from. <laughs> That'd be so funny if they could interact with However, them. However, they are now freaking out the hall. On the job? SMH my head. It's not their job to do this. They're, they're just observers. They're supposed to be proctoring the exam. They can't be drunk while they proctor the exam. If they drink enough, will they give us a good grade? You don't want... Get some more that. beer. <laughs> more also, beer? Also, as a note, Letty, inside oh. here, your mother cannot track you. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> At least time. Nice. Can I insight Mary? I want to message Mary. <laughs> like, like, actually, what? I'm going to ask her, um, who are you? She's Mary. Yes, but what do you do? She's a maid. How does she know the prince? I, I don't have message. How do you know the yeah. prince? Yeah. She met him on the job. Falling in love. He treated her so oh. badly. Oh, she's a predator. Okay, yeah, she died. <laughs> Oh, groomer. Oh, my God. I mean, guys. right. And she's canceled. He let's, was a minor. Let's go. Let's go. Easy trial. It's the, like, 1300s. <laughs> 16 is an adult and? today. Shut up. So, so canceled. Six year age difference. Wait, longer written. Jeez. Call that post so, on wait, Tumblr. Is, is the mouse helping me? Can he help me? Anders, stop. Yeah, he can. Jesus Christ. Then. 
I will try an, a different insight and see if I get a better roll. <laughs> there we go, slightly better. I guess I want to see if she's like telling the truth about screaming I didn't do it, or if she's just desperate to not die. But the 12. You're not entirely sure. You don't know if it's a cry for help or if she did do it. The only thing you know is that she is about to be killed. Okay. Um, lady who were right, right next to them. Hey, uh, how do they know she did it? They found her over the prince's body. Dagger in hand, blood covering her uh, apron. Things. But she was, to her. was she a maid? What, isn't that her job to clean that yeah. up? Good enough for me. Let her die. I'm gonna send another message to her. Why were you holding the dagger? She found it when she had walked in the room. The dagger plunged into his heart. Oh, God. Why did you take it out? But like any crime scene, you take it out because you're freaking out thinking you're trying to save him. Yeah, but what does she say? <laughs> Just that, like she. Okay. Like again, magic does ex exist here, so you know, cure wounds and things like that do exist. <clears throat> so she took out the dagger. She kept trying to like heal him, but by the time they had found her, he was already dead. Guys, I don't think she did it. I, I sincerely doubt it as well. Um, I mean, it, it seems like a pretty... If she killed him, then she would have been smarter than letting herself just be found with the body, you know? Okay, but she was totally grooming a minor. Well, yeah, oh. but that's a different problem. <laughs> My god. <laughs> that's a separate issue. <laughs> it also depends on when they met. I mean, it's like a... What, he was 16? That's a six-year age difference. So even if they'd met when she was still a minor, too, she would be, like, 17 to his 12 or something. Yeah, or yeah, that's, yeah that's not helping the case. Mm, also, okay. that you could, freshman you in could. this time period is, like, normal. It's not that Oh, weird. I know. I'm just... I'm you just could ask her when that. she fell in love with him. All right, still only when did you fall in love with him? Two years ago. Two years ago. So when he was 14. This 14? That's still... In That's that worse. time period, it was normal. That's worse. Okay, we're talking about the time period. How is she 22 years old not married off already? That's an She's a fucking point. maid. Yeah, man, no, she's she about to die. Actually, she must actually be a witch. Never mind. She died. <laughs> 22 and unmarried? Can't believe it. Um. Oh yeah. Wait. Do we know the race of the prince? <laughs> Wait. That could change everything. He's human. That could change everything. <laughs> well, what race is the prince? He's human. Is the uh, yeah, royal no, we're back human? to we're back Mary. to dying. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. What race is Mary? Is she a human? She's an elf. Okay, see, oh, wait, that is no, different. Okay, wait, okay, okay. Never, wait that is different. Mind. Yeah, never mind. We're good. Wait, no, that's bad for the prince. Then. Wait, that's totally bad for the prince. Yeah, this she's like 122. Okay, nope. Well, okay, we're, this is a roller coaster. Her. Oh it's my god. Better to again. <laughs> she's an she adult. Understand. You should have just said that she was like 80. She's yeah. an adult. Yeah, but he's not. A so is he, because right he's old enough to rule the kingdom. I highly doubt they would have been handed Wait, over the kingdom a, when he was 16. I need a history check. What's the age of consent of this kingdom? Yeah, because I know the age of <laughs> Hold on, can I roll history? Yes, you can roll history. We need to know this. The age of majority here. Yeah, what's that? <laughs> Please tell us, Dimitri. <laughs> it's 16. Dimitri would know. Okay. Uh, oh, that's still bad. She found him when he was 14. Get fired. Yeah, the, you're 20 and you're looking at this 14-year-old? No, sorry, oh sis. Oh my god. I don't care He's what you're doing. This is the call-out post. 
<laughs> I don't care what year this is. <laughs> like, we're, we'll save Mary because I'm, I don't think she actually killed him. We'll save her and then we'll beat her up for messing around with a 14-year-old exactly. Jesus Christ. <laughs> How dare she create a rob? She's in the guillotine right now? Yes, her, she her, grew uh, it. her uh, I, can just, I can just poof her out. Her head is uh, currently in the, the hole. I and technically, uh, we could Misty step up to uh, up to her if we really wanted to as well. Well, I can just bring her to us. But can you message her again? So that she doesn't like... Ask her if she has any uh, clues as to who might have hurt him or hey. wanted to hurt him. Hey, yeah, I'll message your... her. Do you know who hurt him? She doesn't have a clue. Uh, everybody here loved him. The maids took care of him. The butlers and the tutors adored him. Clearly some more than the others. All right. How far can you uh, teleport her with that spell? Uh, it has a range of 90 feet, so I can teleport her all the way anywhere within 90 feet of me. You just put her in the middle of us. I could do so that. So it has to be 90 feet from you or 90 feet from where she currently is? 90 feet from me. Oh, okay. Cause so if could, someone's like, at max range, I can do us. 180 feet. Yeah. Are you indicating that you're going to be doing this? Yeah. Uh, Lynn's going to back up then. Yeah, probably. Yeah, we can just... Uh, when you do it, let Dimitri know because Dimitri can cast Silent Image to make it look like she's running away. Oh, in like the opposite direction? Yeah. Because yeah, I really well, don't want to fight gender her. <laughs> I really, really don't want to fight. I we could shape shape gender her. Do you that's really want to do that? <laughs> uh, she's kind of at the guillotine right now. I don't think that's a good idea, but... No, I'm in after we got her. her. All right. Are you 100% sure? I, I'm not. Wait, Lastin? I mean, we can ask Mr. Maskman. We have a question we can ask, and I don't know what else we would use it for. Palacio Executioner? We do have a question we could ask. Mm -hmm. Does someone want to ask him if it was her? Or do uh, we just want to... Would that be a what would, that, point? what would it change if it weren't her? Well, no, well, well, it could be like, what would it change if we save her? Yeah, because if he says, no, it was her, she killed him, you just let the executioner do his thing, because she's guilty. But if it's but, not her, and then it's like, totally, yes, we saved her. Season. I think it'd be better to uh, look into the future and see what would change if we saved her. Or what we could repercussions also ask him does it have? Who actually killed the prince or what? Oh, that's an it's excellent like, question. Because, yeah, like, if it was prince. the fact that he was 16 and inheriting the throne, I mean, dagger to the heart is a way to die, man. Well, I mean, I... it, it could should... have been no one. We're, we're looking at the short term. The prince is a better question, I think, because there's multiple answers. Yeah, we're still looking at the short term, though. Not the long term. Look. We don't want a yes or no question, though. Look we at want the something that has a little more meat. Look at the four things that you were told. And careful. The king and queen have a child who's next in line for succession, and others have ulterior motives for when he comes of age. Blood is thicker than water, so which hurts more during betrayal? Getting hurt by your family or being hurt by your friends? And king and queen are talking about their son and how he's going to be a great uh for the kingdom how he's going to do great things to have a dagger in your hands and press it against the heart even if you know it's wrong and could lead to more dire things they're intending to leave a good enough kingdom for him in their stead what was the actual wording of that i actually i didn't get it word for word for what the king and queen said no well, that's right they, they, I also didn't get it worked no, out, but no, that was the gist of it. No, that's right. They, 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 they hope that the way they have ruled up to this point has left their ki their kid, who is going to be the ruler, with a decent enough kingdom where he will not have any. He won't run into like he won't have to make terrible choices mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. going to war or you know, the really tough choices. We 
just go up and ask Billy uh, what the political climate is like and if there's war on the horizon? <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> I did roll a pretty high history roll. Yeah. <laughs> Ayo, Billy, what's the geopolitics like in this area? <laughs> well. What's the going rate for gold? <laughs> <laughs> That's one. <laughs> For everybody. <laughs> what do you Work. mean? I didn't do nothing. Man, I just keep vibing here. <laughs> yes, you did. You were the fire did not see in this situation. With a 26, and you asked the question. <laughs> the day the boy was born, the brother no longer had his mother. Gotcha. Oh, he has a brother. No, the, did we learn that the, there was a brother? No, the king. That wasn't in there. Brother. Oh, of course, it's always the oh. uncle. Yeah, that makes sense. True. It's a scar Man. situation. Unky traitor. That's how it was in the last kingdom too. It's got to be. So, what do we do? All right. Where's the uncle? Can we see him? I'm gonna say the uncle's right. not here. The uncle's not here. Uncle's not here. Stay back. I'm casting Vortex Warp on her. You should tell her not to resist. Yeah, that's what I would Oh, yeah, I'll message her not, sure to not to resist. Tell her I'm <laughs> trying to help her, and then I'm going to cast Vortex Warp on her. The poor is just massaging her temples right now, isn't she? Oh, no, she's like halfway down a barrel of mead. Oh, dear. Um, Did you tell Dimitri before casting Vortex Warp? You would have, yeah. Okay, so Dimitri will then... If if you cast it, uh, Dimitri would cast Silent Image to make it look like uh, she's running away instead of just poofing. Are we actually doing that? Yeah. yeah. Need to know. All right. She moves. And Silent Image. I'm gonna makes... put her um, Doesn't in matter the middle of the group be, back there. She'll be over here. Oh, okay. She hiding on the table with Billy? Well, no, because if I throw her in there, she gets added to the thing. We got you. Remember to snap the grid. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, Rick. Ah, oh, beans. Oh, no, then... I'm up front. <laughs> yeah, why are you up front? We have I no thought front we were line. putting her back here behind us so we could protect her. No, I did put her back there, but she poofed. Actually poofed. Oh, don't worry. They're all rolling like that. Why do I still have your familiar? It's uh, still on you. You get the advantage now. All right. Goodness. Let us. Uh... I need to hit initiative, huh? You do need to hit initiative, yes. <laughs> no, I don't. Continue. <laughs> that was first level. Boop. Works. And then the silent image looks as if she somehow wrenched herself out of the stocks and she is like literally just booking it, man. She is going so fast. Mm. Red bot, what's going on here, bud? Hello. Hmm? Still playing music. He was trying to play LeBlanc or LeBron versus Russ. The fuck? What? All right. LeBron and Russ post triple doubles in Lakers win versus Rockets. Holy shit. Hey, yo. Oh, 
but cat, you're up. Uh. You already know what I'm about to do. There we go. Um. Question is, who the fuck am I doing that to? Yeah. Yeah. Your mother. My mother is a fine lady. Ish. Uh. <laughs> Valid. Um. Fuck it. I'm gonna Eldritch Blast the Archer guy. Okay. Can't believe you'd be that mean to him. It'd be like that. It really do. Um. Wait, here, hold on. Fuck it. We'll put Hex on them too. Why not? Because I'm stinky like that. Okay. Okay. I gotta remember how to play fucking Warlock, because I've never actually played a full one. You just cast Eldritch Blast every turn. True! Much. <laughs> True! That is slanderous. <laughs> okay, hey, if I'm able, I'm picking up Eldritch Blast whenever I finally reach the fourth one in Lorebard. What are you talking about? Oh, that's a miss. Sure is. It's, all, it's always those that miss. All right, we're it's also, also a fantastic start. <laughs> uh, nice. Should have done more rolls to get all the sillies out. Yeah. No, that's cringe. I, I take my rolls like a man. Um, or you don't. And then I will move you back can... like twenty-five feet, and then that'll be my turn. Smile. Yeah. Uh... What? Oh, no, it's him moving closer to us, slowly but surely. Oh. Okay. Uh, so, Teeny. Me? You're a strong, independent woman who don't need no man, right? Yeah, sure. I need you to give me a strength save. Fuck you. <laughs> okay. Three bars? You should have taken your familiar back. No, he can't help but saves. Oh no! What do you, wait, does he move another twenty feet? He's me? going to rush you. Oh no! Well, I got a fifteen. Fifteen. Don't take this what? away from me. <laughs> oh shit! It's LeBron and Russ. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it's I'm playing it now. Oh okay. Fifteen, fifteen. We'll make it. You take take half of that. Ow! I don't want to take damage unless okay. I do it to myself. What the heck? All right, Ben, you're on deck. All right, I'm gonna move up and. Smack this man because he's beaten up on the friends. <laughs> oh my god, she called you a friend. All I got is her friends. Yeah. Ah! We're all Wait, friends because we're in the same Jerry. Room. That's how it works. Oh, we're, right. we're, we're, we're literally classmates. <laughs> <laughs> There's a word for that, and it's classmates. <laughs> all right, okay, go ahead. So, uh, Jerry, can Jerry help back in the first attack? Yes. Hmm. Okay, so I have advantage. On the yeah, in the first one. First hit, yeah. That is. You know, well. like, yeah. Oh, wait, no, 18 to hit. That'll hit? So, uh, that's five piercing damage. That is five piercing damage. You have. And here, let me. I want to check one. my monk thing because I know I can make an unarmed strike as a bonus action after each attack action or just once per round? Well, once per round. So you go. Okay. Uh, action, action. Bonus action. Okay, so I'll just attack twice then. Mm -hmm. And I only get advantage on that first attack, yep. right? Oof. That is a miss. Dang. Alright. Time to bring out the claws. Yep. Hey, what kind of... Well, what's this dude wearing? 
Uh, a majority of them are wearing, uh, like, cloth and armor, so it's not, like, full armor, but it is a garrison, so it's got, like, plates in, like, slots for armor. Okay, but is this dude wearing, like, metal armor? He is. Yes, he is. Would lightning damage be more effective against him? No, but it would be a dick move. Well, I'm going to do that anyway. <laughs> I don't care if it's not more effective. It's going to happen. Oh. Oh, my. I oh. tried to splash him, and that don't go so well. You, you, you tried to call down the thunder of the gods, you're like... No. How about no? <laughs> All right, Dimitri. It is, it is in it's, fact, your turn. It's Dimitri's turn. Also, you don't have to worry about uh, martial checks and stuff in this one, because it's just a standard. Oh, gotcha. Um, I have not played a bard in a while, so I have to look how to do inspiration and jump. Inspiration is a bonus action. Yeah. Um, is there a I'm wondering how far away I can be in order to cast or to in order to use it? Thirty feet. Thirty feet? So you're thirty or sixty, but you're within a close proximity of each other, so you're fine. Yeah. Um He's wondering who he should cheer on with his Bardic inspiration. I'll be oh. okay. You'll be okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay, right. Mom. I'm bleeding. Mom's bleeding now. I mean, he could cast Fireball. It's true. Oh. He does have that. <laughs> he won't, though. He won't, though. Uh, Bard uh, Inspiration is 60 feet, and they have to be able to hear you. Okay. Oh, so not when silenced. Got it. So don't pick up silence. Yeah. And it's still a D6 because you have to be a uh, Bard uh, fit for it to be D8. Alright, um... I, I'm gonna use... Fuck off. Sh shocking... Wait, no, that's not what I want. Ah. Sorry, I'm looking at my stuff. No, you're fine. Lyndon, you are on deck. I'm behind her. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to... use... Firebolt on Soldier Boy. It should be 2d8, I believe. Yes, you are level or 5. Or 2d10. Yes, 2D so it 10. should be 2d10. You are level 5. I don't think that hit. Did that hit? No. No. Okay. Um, And then he would cheer on Linden uh, with a bardic inspiration. Ooh. Okay. He would just say some encouraging words, basically. Oh, thanks. <laughs> he throws up two two thumbs up. He was being genuine. <laughs> and then returns the thumbs up and gets his crossbow out. And uh he's gonna look at the archer who also has this fucking sick ass crossbow. And uh is going to take a shot at him. But about his knee. Uh in his whole career right now. Do I want to sharpshooter it? It's my stab. That would be, that would be, that would be you do big pop damage. You do have a bardic. I do. I'm going to sharpshooter the first attack. God damn. <laughs> okay. Holy shit. Uh, right. Okay, so I'm going to do a couple of things here. Uh, I'm going to, uh, first off, I'm going to bursting arrow that one. Okay. Which is this button. So... They take nine force damage instead of these two. And then I'm going to spend a superiority die to disarming strike him. Are you sure? Yes. Also, uh, if you look in the classes on hookers and blackjack, uh, I got nerfs. Unchained fighter and Mac Queen. Did he uh, finally release his big one? Uh, no. Or I, his version? No, I had uh, to ask for it because uh, of... Uh, issues but i do have linden built around that one yeah that, yeah that's fine but that'll and... give you more yeah, and here's the superior die which is another five damage on top of that to who uh the archer themselves okay i believe that's how it's worded i can let me click the button doesn't 
that also add to the damage? Yep. So that's the five towards the damage of the 23. So they're taking 28. You already got it applied. Uh, now they're going to make a strength save, uh, and they have to pass my DC, which is eight. Uh, eight plus three plus five. So they lose their weapon. All right. Anything else? Uh, yeah, my extra attack. Which is just also going to be a sharpshooter. Fuck it, I don't care. Bop. Hey. That, that's understandable. Apparently we did not learn we do, You Sunday do have an game. additional D6. Hey, D6 is not going to save that. Yeah, it's <laughs> not going to save that. Yeah, D6 no, ain't going to save that. That's the duality of Linden. We did not learn from Sunday, did we? They're, uh, they're low enough. I'm going to accent church, and I'm going to do it all <laughs> over again. God. Bop. <laughs> all right. Is he dead? Okay, nice. Woo! Kill the, um, kill the one, man. Okay, so which one looks like a? Uh, I'm gonna look with my eyes. Which one looks like a bigger threat? Uh, All the of knight, them. The executioner or the fighter? All of them. Okay, well that's one the is also closer. Well, that is a good point. I can only expend one superiority dies a turn, right? Yep. All right. Um. That sounds about right. But I have the page over right now. Yeah, I can only use one. Whoa. One maneuver per attack. What are you going to do? I'm not going to blow my load entirely. I'm going to... Oh, my. He closed the um, They're going next. I'm going to shoot the fighter. Okay. But I'm going to... Yeah, fuck it, sharpshooter. Okay, understandable. Duality of sharpshooter. <laughs> Can that be saved by a D6? Uh, no. No. Okay. You would be um, one off, even if you did have a uh, full six. In that case, that'll be my turn. Okay. I just fucking destroyed a guy. You did. He's going to jump down here. To about here. And who did you sh shoot, Cat? She has to shoot the archer. Uh, archer? Well, that archer was his best drinking buddy. Damn, that's us. Eddie just fucking murdered him. So. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so he is going to uh, rush Linden. Oh, fuck. And then look. Wait, you goes by me? Hey, yo, I'm taking the nap. Go ahead. Remember, ask me a dagger. Oh. Yeah, I know. I just don't have the fucking macro for you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, for, for a fucking dagger? I have a... I have, I have a dagger. A dagger. 22 yeah. for what? Oh. Four damage. Alright. Lynn, give me a strength saving throw. Ah, uh, fuck. Uh, you do have your bardic inspiration. I don't know if that helps at all. I think I think it is. 1d6. Mm -hmm. Use uh, within the next 10 minutes on attack roll or saving throw, yeah. Okay. Ah. Oh. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I I would. I don't think I don't think I don't think your bardic inspiration. <laughs> yeah, I I, 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 I would. Why didn't you get all your sillies out earlier? Take eight points of damage, and I did. They were on my sharpshooters. And uh, Letty, as he r rushes you, every attack past this point will have advantage on you until the end of your next turn. Oh shit! You also. You also have disadvantage on strength and dex saving throw, or checks. Okay. All right. It's the fighter's turn. All right. I have stolen the dagger macro. Uh, he said eight damage. Got it. Yep, eight damage. She's gonna go here, and. Smile. Okay, 
Beautiful flourishes here. Look. They did. Uh, yeah, it's my bow. Uh, she will take out her long bow and she's going to aim for Cat. One. Not two. Ow, okay. One of hits. Uh, dip in. All right. Then we go to the night. I should. I need to make a con check. Hold on. Yes, you do. Boop. Yeah, I'm good. And she's going. And he's going to aim for it. He's going to aim for Finn. One, Jesus, a two. Finn takes 11 points of damage. Unless you somehow have AC higher than 24. Sorry, what? Take 11 points of damage unless you have AC higher than 24. Uh, I sure don't. <laughs> yeah, you you, re you really, you, you really should have taken that. That AC <laughs> higher than 24. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible for me to get even <laughs> that high. Oh, I've Just done it before. Dip into uh, <laughs> dip into barbarian, and then also be a uh, night watch. It is possible. It is just very difficult. Mm -hmm. All right, teeny, you're up. <laughs> okay. Jerry should not be on there. <clears throat> All of them need to roll a saving throw because I'm casting slow. And it oh. hits everybody. Uh, it doesn't hit allies, though, because I can select the targets. Um, but for RP value, everybody starts to feel sleepy for a second before I slept targets. Ooh. Sleepy. Sleepy. Uh, I'm going to move you slightly down real quick. There you go. Executioner do. Okay. So the soldier and the fighter have the effects of slow right now. And it's a lot. Um, I'm now going to bonus action disengage. And go over here. Okay. Is that it? Um, yes. Alright. Okay. You're up. Okay. Um. Okay. I will start blasting the fighter, I guess. Blast him. I do be blasting. Now, the fighter is slowed compared to the knight yes. and the executioner who are not. Correct. It's true. That'll hit. <clears throat> Roll again. Here we go. Hee <laughs> hee, I blast. <laughs> um, yeah, that's about all I'm doing. Smile. Y'all got this. You can add text to that. Oh, really? If you hack them, you can. Uh -huh. X is bonus action, too. Yep. Like, well, no, the archer died, so you can transfer. Oh, right. So you can use your bonus oh, okay, action I did, to transfer yeah. hex to somebody else. My bad. Oh, I totally I, forgot. I forgot. Yeah. yeah, then so, I'll do that. So roll uh, 2d6. Yeah. noise anything else uh nope okay 
Soldier would get okay. to go, and... You know, he's feeling kind of froggy. Maybe. Bop, bop. So they take step. Just checking the macro. So, uh, yeah, seven more damage to me, I assume. Yep, seven more damage. And that's all they can do. And it is your turn. Bonk him. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Mind you, the crowd at this point has slightly dispersed, and they're kind of running away with some guards heading their way now. What? Um, I did use the silent image to try and make it look as if the person that was being executed is running away. Is there any chance that that could have caused a distraction, or did I just waste a spell slot? Uh, no, no. They're not going to join the battle. It just means that when you clear this fight is when you'll have to run. Gotcha. So... Can we take can we take Aku Aku with us? No. Oh no. Unfortunately Aku Aku cannot leave uh does not get to leave. Ah cool. Can we I guess somebody will have to waste their bonus action or something to go ask him a question. Alright, Finn, you're up. You... Is this what you wanted? <laughs> Who do you punch? Okay. Or stay up? Uh question. So <laughs> My Breath of the Dragon, it can be either a 30-foot line or a 20-foot cone. Mm -hmm. Do I have to step back to have that cone hit all three of these dudes here? Yes, you do. Okay. Then I will use my Step of the Wind to disengage as a bonus action. Okay. Make and... sure to spend your key okay. point. Yeah. Take Jerry with you. Take <laughs> Jerry with you. That's... <laughs> Uh, okay. Sorry, I, I'm trying to measure to make sure I get her in it, too. Nope, you're good. Here. He's our man. If he can't do it, nobody can. Uh, darn, I don't know if I can get all of... all three of them in it. It's only a 20-foot cone. 20-foot cone. What about the 30-foot line? How big is the line? Is it just... One by one? I I assume. Let me double check in the yeah, monster. That's a, I don't think there's a way for you to mathematically do a 20-foot cone on all three of them. But the 30-foot line would include the fire. Yeah, 30-foot line is five feet wide. So it would include the knight? Because they're right next to each other? Or Oh, I am so sorry. I thought I had my like if, tape. If, if the line is passing between them, or if... Here. I think you could only get two of them. Yeah. Darn. Yeah. Probably the that soldier and the fighter so that you can take the, the fighter out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna... Would I hit a... them from here with a 20-foot cone? Yeah, I would. If you do this, this is a 30-foot line as well. Okay. I'm gonna do 30-foot cone... Not 30-foot. 20-foot cone from here. <laughs> Can't talk. <laughs> so I'm gonna... Breath of the Dragon... I just gotta figure out which damage type. So, like, there's no type of damage that would be especially effective against them, would it? At the moment, no, right now. They're, they're just kind of mooks. They're not, like, <sighs> yeah. anything big. They're just, like, we we hate our job, but we're here. Well, then, for flavor, I'll just breathe fire. Okay. So Perfect. Thing. As you breathe fire, the rat on top of your head is going to mimic you and breathe fire. It does absolutely nothing, but it looks horrible. <laughs> it looks like a little bat stick flame. It just poof! Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. And. Let's do that up quick. So minus two from the bees. So oh, the, the soldier and fighter both have disadvantage on their deck save. Oh, slow. Both slow. slow. Yeah. It just says minus two penalty. Is it minus two? It's yeah. to AC. I thought it was. It oh, yeah, no, minus it is two minus two to the dex. Okay. Well, that didn't work. No, they, they still take the damage. Just half. They just take half, right? Oh, they just take half? Yeah.
That fighter's just standing up there okay, like, man, yeah, I haven't even hit anybody yet. Yeah, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> and does that count as one attack action? Uh, If it's an action, it's your whole action. Mm. Okay. Or the breath, if I'm correct. That sounds right. Wait, no. It says when you take the attack action, you can replace one of the attacks with this. Okay. So you can go and so punch. I can still make... So you can go and punch one of them. Uh... I should go short sword one of them. <laughs> so I'll move up to like here. Okay. Yeah, and short sword at this dude. Just oh, to do, do I turn. get advantage on that or not because I'm mouse? Oh, yeah, he's helping you. So yeah, you. Good. Okay, cool. Mouse time. He's just trying to do his job, and you just walked up and shanked him. I mean, he, he's hit me a couple times before this. I have no sympathy for him. You disrupted an execution! You have no well, proof. She just disappeared. <laughs> you just came up and started wailing on my friends. <laughs> Alright. Dimitri, go. Alright, so I don't like being so close to Mr. Man here, but I wouldn't be able to disengage without using an action, right? Or would Correct. it be your... Okay. So I guess Mr. Man's gonna have to stay there. Um, is Scylla feeling well enough? Should I heal her? I have one healing spell. She's a 24 out of 42. Yeah, maybe. Um, Dimitri seeing the one person that he probably thinks most of as his friend getting hurt doesn't like that. So he's going to cast Healing Word at Scylla. Thank you. You get two healing. Plus your stat mod that looks yeah. like you have the broken macro. Yeah, probably. Sorry, I can this. fix it. Thank you. Um, my it would be my spellcasting modifier, right? Correct. Yep. Um, uh, it'd be a plus. Three. I believe it's plus three. Or is it? Is your and my my spell my sheet says spell at uh, spell attack plus six. I don't know what that means. What is your charisma modifier? What my is your charisma, charisma is plus three. So it's plus three. Okay. So five total? Yep. Cool. There you go. You get you get a little bit of healing. Right. And then um Macro fixed. Thank you, I appreciate it. Yeah. Anything else? Uh, I am checking that right now. Whee. Um he will, after sending the healing to Scylla, will um, also get her a bardic inspiration point to use. That's... Alright. Um, and he will kind of yell a cheer like, keep going! Don't stop! <laughs> God, I'm bleeding. <laughs> He's not even hit yet. <laughs> Alright. Let me break out the Corvad quotes. Uh, you get a plus no. 1d6. <laughs> um, no, you do not get the Corvad quotes here. So yeah, that'll be his turn. Those are... Those are inspiring, though. All right, well, then who are you going to blow your load on now? Well, first I'm gonna I'm gonna do the biggest of programmer moves. Uh, they don't teach you this at school, and they don't want you to know about it. Mm -hmm. But I'm about to teach you. You all ready? Fool me. Hey yo. Big play. Does he do anything? Are you sure about that? Play. Yes. Oh, Letty. Jeez. Letty. Okay. Reese's and pieces? That hits. Where is it? Worth. <laughs> All right, Wait, go Letty, ahead. Letty, 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 Letty. Program remove one more time. Ah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do it again. Ah. Oh. Okay. I attack her with the sharpshooter. Yeah, I'm gonna bardic that. Wait, no, that's that a fighter hits. lady? Yeah, wait, wait, yeah, that hits, because she hits. slid. Minus 2 AC. Oh, nice. She's down. Okay. Uh, ah, that guy. Okay. I'm gonna fucking sharpshooter it. Ah. Is that it? And then I'm yeah. gonna bursting arrow it. Ah. Sound effects are making it for me, to be honest. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And required. then... Um, you were here busting. Uh, uh, 
I guess that's... Mm, I can't really do much else. Kind of my turn. Alright. Yeah, that be it. I'm in danger. You are in danger, unfortunately. <laughs> he doesn't want to go hit Linden. <laughs> Linden, who has actually done damage, versus Dimitri, who is literally not. <laughs> no, you're small. No, I'm just a little call ball. Hey, we have three employees, please. <laughs> Make a little guy. Yeah, you, you can't. You, I'm little... just a little guy as this one, cunt. <laughs> Come on, bro. <laughs> I'm. This may hurt. I'm sorry. How dare you? And then nice silver bar. <laughs> um, hold on. <laughs> My AC is 14, so okay. one of them doesn't hit. I take 7 damage. Alright, give me a dexterity saving throw. Okay. Dexterity. Boop. Okay, you do not have your legs swooped out from under you. Congratulations. <laughs> I don't know why he has a plus 13. Um, I do need to take damage, though. Yes. Boop. And it's 7, right? Yep, 7 damage. Night I movie. do. This one will go for Scylla. Oh, jeez, that barely even dipped in. Neither of those hit. You have quadruple expertise and dexterity saving throws. Why? What? Oh, it's because you... I didn't think I know why. When it comes to it, you, uh, you just increase the value by one if you have saving throw in it. Oh, okay. I don't or know what... I just pushed the button. I just pushed the button. <laughs> There you go. Uh -huh. Hold okay. up. Uh, I'll, I'll fix it. Don't worry. Thank you. All right. Good night, Went. Teeny, you're up. I want to obliterate one of them. Um, okay. Only one? Why not? I mean, I'm this one right here is low on health. So. Well, I can only really. Well, I don't know how much damage it'll do, so it's partially a damage test. There you go. It's fixed. Do it on the night. Thank you. He's almost dead and he's right next to me. Uh, no, it'll do a lot more than that damage is the thing. Oh. Okay. Fair yeah, enough. Yeah, you'll want to obliterate the soldier, I think. Or the executioner, well, I mean. The soldier's the slowed, executioner so I'm is going to cast health. using Blood Gamble, third level magic missile on Mr. Executioner. Wow. Uh, that... Uh, do I want to reroll that? Hmm. <laughs> do I want to reroll that, or do I want to just say fuck it and take it? I'm going to say fuck it and take it. So six times four, because I'm using the damage increase, makes that 24, so I add 12 damage to it. Uh, and then I'm also going to use Fury of the Small to add another five damage to it. So that's 17 plus... That. Uh, five, ten... 15 18 18, 18 plus 17 17 plus 18 so 35 yeah is that 35 mm -hmm. 17 plus 18 yes all right all right but that's not hurt so uh also just ignore this you just don't worry about this ow mm -hmm. is that it uh yeah okay Cat, you're up. Uh, I'm gonna move Hex to the Executioner. Okay. And then I will blast. I'm also eating dinner, so. Beats rolls? No. Because that would Tind be gay. Tindy? No, it's like pasta and shit. No. Oh. Yo, sick. Well, uh, we hit. Uh, the Executioner. 21. Here you go down. Thank you. You have saved your friend. Nodders. Alright. Still up there holding the front line. <laughs> yeah. I'm you got alone. this. Soldier will get to go. Building. You're not alone. You have Jerry with you. Wait, I misadded that. Hold on. Well, that first one hits me. Yep, so take another five. <sighs> then then it's your turn. Great. Well, bonk him. Did you just Twist crack it. your All knuckles right. on my cool <laughs> Yes, I did. Good Dramatic Lord. effect. That sounded spicy. I liked it. 
I'm about to fuck okay. this night up. Uh, let's see. Uh, Your joints are filled with pop rocks. Something is frightened of me. Do I get advan advantage on attacking them, or does it only give them disadvantage to attack me? Disadvantage to attack. It only gives them disadvantage. Okay, then I'm not gonna bother with that right now and just go full on short sword on Mr. Soldier over here who just took a swing at me. Oh. Almost dead. And I get one advantage attack because of Jerry, right? Correct. Yeah. Okay. Oof. And it, that's with advantage. Like that sometimes. Yeah. Regular attack. Let's go. You don't think it'd be like that, but it do. That unfortunately is a miss. All right, then I'm gonna use uh, flurry of blows so that I can make two unarmed strikes. Yep. And that's only one key, I think. Yeah, that's one key. So two unarmed strikes at the dude. Okay. Oh. Oh. And then more, and then some poison just for flavor. Oh, some All right. Dude, dude, just trying to enjoy the festival. They were literally trying to guillotine a woman. That's their yeah. festival. God. That's a, yeah, it is a festival. I mean, that was entertainment back then, but it's not not okay. They, they never said it was okay. I mean, she's a groomer, so I mean... Oh my god! Dimitri, go. Just go for a fucking <laughs> boot, Letty. You could have just made her an 18-year-old maiden. It would have been fine. <laughs> it's not the narrative, damn it. Even an 80-year-old elf would have been better. Um... I'm going to... Knight. Uh, I'm going to jump touch the knight. Yeah. Now, can't believe Dim oh. Dimitri oh, killed someone. Him. Has chill touch? Oh, Dimitri got hands. Oh, so chill, chill touch. touch. <laughs> oh, we got two chill touches. We got two Ew. chill touch bitches. <laughs> hey, yo. Um, All right. Glad I didn't take that cantrip. Anything else you want to do, Dimitri? I don't think I have any bonus action things, so no. All right, Lyndon, kill him. I do. I do the thing. Bye. Pew pew. pew. All right. I don't have any more arcane archer shit to do. He's dead. Doesn't matter. So you oh. Did. Okay. Thing that killed him. But I have one more shot. <laughs> Shoot him <in> there. <laughs> the him. king and the queen are right over there, man. <laughs> oh, no. I mean, technically, you shoot it in the air and it falls down, and I have long. to dodge it. <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's a magical arrow, so it'll dissipate in the sky anyways. Fucking so victory shot, a. Hey. All right. As you disperse the guards, and you see the w w woman in question uh, turn and go immediately for w one of the guards. Huh? And then stabs him. Fuck what? It. What? Mary does? Yep. One of the guards we just killed? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. That was like a new guard. Those guards aren't dead. They're unconscious. Oh. Oh, we hey, weren't going to um, kill? You, what do you, you don't have <laughs> to was, do that. I was aiming to kill. <laughs> I was not doing non-lethal damage. I, I'm an archer. I can't non-lethal. Yeah, you can. Yeah. I'm a mage. I can't lie to people. <laughs> I just touched a guy with necrotic damage. Um, intent was there. <laughs> it was a and poisoned a man. I was not trying to keep him alive. <laughs> hey, lady, what are you, what are you doing? You here? Are we, uh, are we still snapped here? Yeah. Uh, okay. you can are we still in combat? No. You can hear her okay. say to you, thank you for helping me escape. Now the war will start. What? Okay, bye. See, this is why we ask the question, what happens if we free her? Oh, what? hold on. If she just said, now the war will start, I would have attacked her. Well, that's where the trial ends. Oh, okay. You see the screen go black and white. I tried to tell y'all we should have done the question. <laughs> you see Aku Aku. 
for a coup. So, well, can't say it was the uh, proper results, but not bad. I mean, not bad. That's not our question. <laughs> See, well, he will then he will then ask you. This is not going to answer to answer his question. He asked you, "Are you satisfied with your results?" No, not really. There wasn't really a right answer here. I, I feel like there kind of was. He looks at you and goes, then you fail. Dimitri will shrug. Alignment yeah. good. Yeah, that sounds about <laughs> right. I didn't really care. You should have let me stab the baby. What there baby? Was no what? There wasn't a baby. <laughs> We're not affiliated with her. <laughs> He <laughs> tells you that there was no winning or losing to the trial. Okay, then how would we have succeeded? Where you failed was you did not accept what you did and stood your ground. Well, you asked if I was satisfied. I was satisfied, I guess. I did what I thought was right. And that's I don't... and that's the point of the trial. He points out how you all came to a deductive reasoning that you believed was right. He even points out how you excel at your certain things. Like, for example, Lyndon going for the disarm. And things that happen in the combat. Both are good. The trick was even if you are a normal person, if you're a hero, even if you're a king, when you make a decision, you have to stick with it. You can't second guess, you can't take it back, because once it's done, it's done. If you... That's also what we said, was that there was no right answer, meaning regardless of what we had done, things would have continued on their course. I don't know. I still would have liked to have more information. I mean, yes, I'll, I, I agree. I would like to have known a little bit more before we had to act. But yeah, the... it's, I can see why we failed. But no, that that's part of it. You weren't given the whole skill. You had to make a decision based on what you had. Not on the full well, I mean, we had a question that we never used. There was never a question. Yeah, no, this is like the challenges in the Great, Great British Bake Off when they don't tell you how to make the thing. They just give you the instructions and the recipe. Exactly. And then they don't know what the fuck they're cooking until they actually make it. <laughs> <laughs> who, are you, uh, who are you firing at there, Lyndon? Uh, the one breaking so... the fourth wall. <laughs> so then, like... They'll be like, what the hell is this? And then they'll make it and they'll be like, yeah, I think that's what that looks like. <laughs> and then the judges are like, no, that's not what that looks like. That's exactly what's going on here, except it's fantasy. I hope Chad anyway, is making you every roll. Great British Bake Off. <laughs> Stop great British Bake Off. Buttons. How many times I gotta crate you? <laughs> you cannot kill that, that which embraces the cringe. <laughs> you're, you're going for the fourth <laughs> wall. You're going for the chat. Yeah. Stop, stop farming Omega Laws, simp. <laughs> what? Who's Omega Law me? I'm gonna be honest, I forgot we were streaming. Yeah, we're streaming. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> <laughs> you, you, see, you see, you can go. Simply put, had this been a real trial, you would have failed. Okay. Dimitri's <laughs> not here to get good grades. He's here no. to learn. Yeah. <laughs> I'm here to 
Apa? <laughs> well, this is an adequate thing, and I can finally leave. Wait, so what happens now? Well, nothing. We have to do this again. Are there different trials, or are we just going to do the same one again? No. Does this mean I don't have to be royalty now? <laughs> See? I can leave now. Wait, I thought you weren't supposed to be here. If this was a real trial, yes. I've been watching the whole time with Aku Aku. I want a sick mask. <laughs> He's not Man, wrong. I didn't sign up for this. I signed up for monk studies. <laughs> but you see, that's just it. The test was to see how far you go. However, I want to offer you this. I can show you a place that has everything you guys want. The thirst for knowledge lies down below. The finding monasteries, unforgotten. Finding night orders that have been, that have disappeared from time. Finding magics of untold that could put you even above the Witch of the East. And gaining fame and fortune as she stares at Cat. Oh. You could have just said, uh, <laughs> the, the, the gym. Gym. Yeah, the <laughs> this test was simply to see if the if Tartarus would actually take you, which mildly it will. Not every test is going to have an answer, nor will it be right or wrong. But what I'm asking you is this. Do you want to see that world below? The thing we turned the wheel for and then I teleported him out of? Yeah, what happened in that room? Oh, <laughs> uh, you see images from the past. Ah. I really do think maybe the writing on the wall needs to be a little bit more specific. Can we keep the pickles? <laughs> yes, you can keep the pickles. Can we keep the pickle jar? Yes, you can keep the pickle jar. Awesome. Wait, watching the whole time? Yes. I'm not giving the dagger back. It, that's fine. Carter's gave it to you, not me. Dimitri is just kind of smiling smugly at the papers in the book that Wait, he took. Wait, I gave <laughs> the dagger. But what I'm asking you is this. I can show you all of these things. I simply just need you to trust me. Yeah, okay. Making crunch noises. <laughs> he, yeah, he's still eating pickles. And if that works, I will make you into people that even kings fear. I don't want to be feared. I'm just here to learn. Exactly. You can join even the top scholars with what you'll learn. It is a tempting offer. I'm I'm kind of not good at this whole royalty stuff, though. Well, that's fine. This is not to get you to become a king or queen. This is not to push you to be something you don't want to be. I'm simply offering you things you want. Not in a sexual way. Friendship? <laughs> you said that was a sexual look. Friendship? Friendship. <laughs> It's bad enough cats over here lusting after the gym mm -hmm. teacher. We don't need inter-party romance. Mm -hmm. Listen, they're teenagers. Mm -hmm. That doesn't yeah, stop the half fuck? the shows on TV. What the fuck? Why can't I, like, teenager lust after Listen, the teacher? This, what the fuck? This is more realistic. That's just... Uh, uh... 
this is one that's actually happened before. So. <laughs> yeah. But with that being said, you did well. In fact, like how your other teachers pointed out, the things you excel in, you do very well. <laughs> Making them go boo. Yes. <laughs> your for the matrix the search for knowledge you found many things. Important and quite good. Your need for magic will find you many things down below. With that said, we can we can't go back now. What do you mean we can't go back now? We can go back now. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, because I have another class in about looks at looks at sundial watch probably <laughs> like thirty minutes. Don't you remember time froze? Oh yeah, that's right. Are you taking all night classes? Well, kind of. That's how my life was back in the boot camp. Oof. We no have says... gym night classes. Yeah. Do they? Not for you. What do you mean, not for me? <laughs> <laughs> you know why. That, that teacher's not there. No. When, when is he there? In the day. You wouldn't know. He must be a level 5 friend. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, with that being said, what do you say? Let me invite him to tea parties. <laughs> you went down the wrong storyline to meet him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, so, what do you say? Do you want to see the bottom? I, I definitely want to see magic, more. I want to. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm bottom. Back. I don't know if I, I want to go through the effort of going all the way to the bottom. I well, don't know. I'm kind of seeing the bottom right now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, here's the thing. With enough information and how well you will excel, it won't take you very long. So that's why I say to ask to trust me. Because I will make it so you can get there safely. Why do you all have height buttons? Why not? <laughs> yeah. I got a palette and I got a height button. Yeah, why don't you? <laughs> So you help me God, I don't have buttons? the... Yeah, join the club. You should know this campaign. We all make buttons just randomly. Yeah. Oh, damn. Hold on. Let me go get the dick macro. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> but for the time being, let us head back. It's getting close. Then you have to go find out how tall I made her again. Hold on. You get his <laughs> macro. It's on him. For all the hell it's yeah! Down in base. <laughs> Sheesh! <laughs> oh, wait, I gotta roll. Oh shit, we do gotta roll. God! Oh my god. There. Oh shit! Damn. I'm not. 12.4! I'm not oh, rolling. I'm god. sorry, I'm not rolling this. There you go. <laughs> what was the uh, small creature again? Oh fuck, hold on. Let me go, let me go pull up my notes here. Not rolling this either. Is it D10? Uh, no, for halflings, because you're a halfling, right? Yeah. It's 1D8, then 1D6 for girth. Okay. What? Why do you have these? <laughs> There's a TikTok and I wrote it down. I'm not rolling. <laughs> Are we just saying that we're full healing, like long rest and all that? You, uh, you guys are going back to the classroom, as the time technically has expired for for what you were doing. As the room dissipates, uh, Akwaku goes back up into the tower. Where you will see him once again at some other point. You will not do the same trial. 
That is just a test run. Wait, that wasn't even level one? Technically it was. Oh, okay. Here we are. Don't worry about your wounds, they will heal over time. Dimitri was already handing a, a small treat to Scylla. Thank you, I owe you my life. <laughs> it's just like a little like granola bar, it tastes like a cookie. Gary's but, gonna scurry back. But tell me, what did you think? I love how we're all just like totally silent in the face of the teacher. <laughs> this is how it would be. Let's be honest. Crossbow bolt really hurt. <laughs> well, the poor wasn't wrong on her reports. More reports. Nothing. What happened to Aku Aku? When? Uh, technically, technically, Aku Aku is is in here. He's just somewhere else. I miss him. <laughs> well, you can just visit the tower again. He, he can come by. <laughs> Will he actually answer a question if I do? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Will he leave? Will he leave after I ask? No. Okay. Here. D I'll... Do we get to have a healer? Yes. What are you Should talking about? With us when we go on future adventures, because I I have healing ability. <laughs> yeah, but you're not a healer. Technically, yes. <laughs> Technically, yes. I'm, I am picking up more healing as well as time goes on. So I gotta say, being up there. on the front lines by myself was not fun. There. I'm sorry. Also, well, no. I'll let you know this. If Barricade dies, then I will make a paladin for you. <laughs> I don't know if she keeps it up. She Why might does she need to die? die? No. What is... Just be a mimic dresser. It's cringe. Wow, okay. No, poison. <laughs> Not the cobbler. Stop deleting my gobblers. No. Not on, not on this map. Alright, fine, but you're no match for the machination. Yes, I can, because I just killed Joker's son. Not the mechanism. No. Why is Mr. Steel your waifu here? So do I need, do I need to bring here? in do I need to bring in my <laughs> spiritual weapon from uh from the Strahd campaign? Is is that what we're but, doing? What is it? The bonk spin. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. You guys get your full rest. As you go back to your classes, or you, you, get, you get your full, you know, eight hours or so, and then you come back to your classes, and that's where we'll end it. Nice. So, a long so rest I get a long rest? You do get a long rest. Yay. Hey. And then we're going to take you butt? back right. to... Uh, oh, hold up. Hold up. Hold on. Token. There we go. I'm good. going to identify both of those items. Wait, have, have you guys gotten to see my newest editions of what? the uh, of the fuck boys? No, you haven't shown us new editions. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to do it on this map. Bring them out so then I can save them and add it to the collection. Ah. Oh, my phone yeah. wasn't Wherever you are, have a good day, have a good night, have a good evening, have a good morning, wherever you are. If you are enjoying the content, please uh, please consider following. We're almost there. And we are uh, four away from, from, from Uh 
Sunday will be the startup of Storm for the Calm. Now that everyone is all sit situated, uh, outside of that, uh, be safe wherever you are. Be excellent.